All right, good evening, everybody. Welcome back. Hope you all had a great weekend there, folks. Coming to you from Arcadia, Florida, more precisely from the clinic, as we call it, uh, right here in beautiful Arcadia, Florida. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to welcome you in. Tuesday night, Diecast TV. Folks, I've got, I pulled together some pretty cool pieces tonight, I think. Uh, I noticed we've got a few things in the backyard there still left over from this afternoon, so we'll hit those up today. Uh, I've got all the factory sets are in here and ready to go, ready to try to see who's interested in those there, folks, see what we can't work out there tonight. Uh, we'll have some, like I said, we'll have some loose ones, some carded. We'll just have some fun all the way around the block there tonight, folks, and we'll get all that started right after that. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, how y'all doing this evening, folks? If you're out there, say hello. Let me know who's hiding out with me out here tonight, folks. Uh, as you know, uh, had a few, couple days off there. Hope y'all had a great Labor Day weekend there. Uh, I spent it um, trying to relax, but that's never an easy thing to do when you're so far behind on your honeydew list, so to speak, and you gotta try to get that caught up there, folks. All right, my friends. Hey, if you're out there, like I said, say hello. Let me know who's hanging out. I've got some goodies here for you tonight, my friends. I've got some goodies. I've got some Ferraris. I've got uh, who knows what. Who knows what we're going to pull out of here tonight, folks. But hey, first and foremost, like we say, let's, uh, let's start out. Let's get these rules up across the board there, my friends. All right, first and foremost, you have to be 18 years of age or older to bid. Uh, we do need you to register first at DieCastTV.com. Uh, doesn't take long to do that at all folks as you know you've all done it uh, we have had a lot of we've had something like close to 30 new registers in the past week and a half and uh, some of them you know I, we know you're out there because you've you've completed the process nobody's just actually bid yet so hey get in there jump in there join us and bid folks don't just sit back and watch get in on the fun as they say shipping's a dollar a car uh, Box fee three fifty US uh, thirteen fifty Canada twenty three fifty international. Now, of course, in the USA, Puerto Rico and Hawaii, fifty dollars in a broadcast day, which runs from the time I sign off to the time I sign off in a twenty four hour period. Uh, that includes everything in the overnight from the stream store through the afternoon through the next evening. You hit fifty dollars. Not too hard to do here. Let me tell you, you're gonna grab that free shipping internationally, folks. Hey, just just keep up with your invoices when we send them out. We try to send invoices out every day, uh, but um, sometimes, you know, they don't come out till the following morning. That's all right. You know, uh, just keep up with them. We build boxes and we'll, we've will we got some pretty good uh, rates on shipping internationally and we'll fire those off to you when they get to a certain size, shape, and yeah, you know. <laughs> you know the spiel there, folks, you know the spiel. All right. Uh, Minimum bids, of course, are bucks, uh, and something is definitely wrong with our, I noticed we've got some issues with our background stuff here, so let me see if I can get that fixed here. All right, that's all looking good now. All right, I see we got Daddy Magic in the house. We got Alex Cooter on checking in there. What's up, what's up, my friends? What is up? Boy, Alex and I were kind of uh, doing the same thing over the weekend, only Alex was definitely doing more of it than I was. I, uh, yeah. I'm still pretty sore from that. Never trimmed a full-size tree in my life, and I did it for the first time Saturday. And I gotta tell you, I'm still hurting from doing that. <laughs> Not something I wanna do every day, that's for sure. All right, let's see here. So, uh, of course, minimum bids are uh, $5. Uh, loose cars, three or five, unless we tell you different. And, uh, other than that, let's have some fun here tonight, folks. What do you say? What do you say? All right. I think those rules have been up there long enough. We'll take those now. All right. So let's get going here. Uh, let me start out by showing you something really kind of cool. Up. Whoop, not that one. That's the one. Check it out here, folks. I got a nice little Ferrari to start the evening. Nice little vintage Ferrari. That's right. I said the F word. I did say the F word this evening. Check this out. This is the Ferrari 348. 
Nice little black wall wheels there, red interior, pink stripes. Kind of a cool piece. All right, car doesn't look to be in too bad a shape here uh, as I look at it. Uh, just a little, just a little chafing kind of like on the edges. Brown back, still a nice little card, all, nice little card, nice little card all the way around there. Pretty cool little Ferrari there. All right, so check it out, ladies and gentlemen there. What do you say? What do you say? Let's get going here this evening. Let's get going. Let's get some bidding. Let's see what happens here. What do you say, my friends? How about it? How about it? How about it? Who likes Ferraris? Any Ferrari folks in the house? In the house, in the house, in the house. I, uh, this isn't looking too well. This isn't looking too well at this start. Because then I guess I really shouldn't show my loose card car over here, should I? Probably shouldn't show the loose one, as we're not getting anywhere on that nice little carded one. Uh, whoops, I do have over here, folks. Uh, of course, wouldn't you know it, I do have another Ferrari. Another Ferrari sitting there. Ay, ay, ay. Uh, let's see, well, we will start the bidding on the loose Ferrari at five bucks. Uh, I would like to see 10 bucks for the one up front. Right there. All right, give me just a second here, guys. One little side effect to my adventure on the weekend was I scratched my eye. Uh, even though I had safety glasses on, some debris managed to get around through there in a nice little gust of wind and uh, put a little scratch on my eyeball. So I've got one eye that's not exactly playing like it should. All right, folks, a nice little Ferrari there. Holy cow, holy cow. Ferrari, Ferrari, Ferrari. All right, now let's go. Let's go ahead and start over here with the elephant in the room, folks. I want you to take a look. We have the 2010, the 2009, 2008, and 2006 factory sealed sets. Factory sealed sets here. All right, check them out. Your 2008 set is still sealed in the shipping container. Uh, so that's not been taken out of the shipping container or out of the box that it's packed in on the inside. Now, there's your 2006 set, there's your 2010, and of course your nice little 2009. Factory sealed sets here, folks. Holy crap. Holy crap. Holy crap. And I noticed that they adjusted the prices on these a little bit. No wonder I couldn't sell them last week. <laughs> All right, so check this out, folks. Now, I will tell you this much. They did say, and I've been told, that all four sets, uh, about $1,000 less than really what their actual, la what the last few sales on these have been. Of course, you know these don't show up very often. Shar, what's up? What's up? What's up? Boy, oh boy, oh boy. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm going to keep Shara's secret here a little bit because she sent me some photos this afternoon, folks, and man, oh man, man, unless she says it's okay to say anything, I'm not going to say. Let's just say that, holy cow, what a, what, what a ride she picked up. <laughs> anyway, uh, so I'll tell you what, folks, we were looking at over $4,000 over $4, worth of value here. Over $4,000 worth of value here in these sets. $3,000 takes all four. And folks, if you want, if you do want it, we will open, and that can be an open invoice, all right? Can and will be an open invoice. Now, individually priced, the 2010 set is 1000 The other three sets start at $750. So add that up. Add that up based on their adjusted prices, and that's still like $3,250, $3,400, something like that. Ladies and gentlemen, Shar is the proud owner of a killer, killer Mustang. She picked up a beauty over the weekend there. Absolutely amazing ride. Let's see here. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let me see if I can find that messenger here. Here we go, here we go. Whoops, that's not it. Ah, here we are. Here we are, here we are, here we are. I'll show you the one photo right here. Let's 
jump up to the very up close up front camera there, right there by that stinking little Ferrari. Man, oh man, oh man. We have a killer, nice little stang banger there, man. Check that thing out, holy cow. That thing is freaking awesome. Absolutely freaking awesome, folks. Man, oh man, oh man. Yeah, now you know, that looks kind of mean there. It does look awful, awful mean, doesn't it? Pretty sweet little deal there. Pretty sweet little deal right there, folks. All right, so, man, oh man, oh man. I will I will tell you this, Sharon. My son's gonna be jealous as all get up because he is a, he, well, he's a, he's told me how many times he wants a Mustang. Uh, he's just got an, he's just got an affliction for Mustang bangers there, so cool stuff. All right. All right, folks, we know Alex is here, we know Char is here, and I know Daddy Magic is here. Hmm, makes me wonder where everybody else is tonight. Oh, well, this, this works out well for those that are here. I'm going to take that Ferrari off the wheel up here because I've got a, <clears throat> a little, uh, something that starts with a J and, uh, and, ha and has a duh in it, uh, you know, a little Jada. Little Jada Dub City piece here. I believe it's a Mercedes, if I'm not mistaken. I don't know, but let's see. Flip that critter over here. Whoop! I look at that. I've gone three days and I can't even hit the right flipping buttons tonight. Check it out, folks. We have a Jada Dub City, and somebody's been playing with the cameras in here, haven't they? Because the focal point is on the back and not on the front center. It's on the back center. Let's see if we can fix that. As we want it front center, not back center on the on the on the focal point. There we go. Check it out, my friends. Check it out. Nice little dub 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 city, right there. How about it? Who to be? Who to be? Who to be? Who to go on the dub 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 city? Check it out, there, folks. Good one. Good one. Good one. My 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 my. All right. Clock is hot. Char is going to grab this one. And Char, I don't think you're going to have much competition right now. According to my data feeds, we've only got about six people all told watching on all platforms. So, uh, must just be me. Must just be me. That's why nobody's here tonight. They're like, oh, it's that, it's that metal dude. Ah, screw him. We'll come back on when Rick's on. We'll come back on in the afternoon. <laughs> Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Five is the bid. Shara has got the deal here. Got the deal on this nice little piece right here. I do not have a logging cart. They filled all the other carts up, so I'm gonna have to do something about that eventually. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Three, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And Shara is gonna take this one. Sold, sold, and sold. All right. Whew. Nice grab on that little critter. Nice grab on that little critter. Well, let me try a nice little AMC Mercedes CLK DDM DTM. Nice little three dollar loose right there. Just type in loose. Type in loose. Type in loose. Well, I guess I'll use this for now as my logging station. That'll work. Here we go here, here we go here. This is almost like a JDM wannabe. Kind of got that style, kind of got those, you know, bends and curves and whatever. And man, that's even worse. Ah, uh, well, that's what happens when they leave me in charge. Everything goes to seed. All right, let's try fixing that a little bit there. Let's see, is that any better? Well, okay, so the focal point is obviously better from the side to the back, I guess, than to the mid to the front, so. All right. Well then, let's see here. Ooh, how about a little 60, let's try a little 67 Caddy. 
Little 67 Cadillac, check that out. You know, I know what it is. I know exactly what the problem is with that camera, is it's drawn in too close. It has been drawn in way too close. That's the problem. Back that out of here. You really need to see the whole thing, not just bits and pieces of it. There we go. Yeah. All right, my friends, there you go. There's three dollars, three dollars, three dollar loose. Just type in loose and grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it. All right, so we'll go back up front. I'll pull this Ferrari. Apparently, right now is not the time to put up Ferraris, is it? All right, guys, I have, cards are a little rough here, but I'm gonna put this, I'm gonna put this set up here, all right? From 1996, of course, it is the Splatter Paint Series set. Now, like I say, the cards have, each card has an issue of some kind to it, all right? So check it out. So you're gonna pick up this four car set for a pretty good price, I would say. Here is the I Rock, the 80s Camaro Z28. Right, and we do have a bit of a uh, crease. All right, here is the the juice machine. Is that what they call that? Seriously? I just thought it was a nice little 57 something or another, but they call this one the juice machine. And last but not least in this series is of course the side splitter, the killer funny car. Good little funny car right there. Splatter paint line folks. All right, so check it out here. I'm gonna start the bidding on the set at five. So $5 will start this on that nice little, nice little uh, splatter paint set right there. Check it out folks. Check it out, check it out, and check it out here, ladies and gentlemen. Once again, uh, camera, bring it over that way just a hair, there we go. And there you go, you got all four cars, splatter paint series, looking for a $5 start. Looking for a $5 bid. $5 bid to get things going here, what do you say there, friends? And Derek's gonna throw a five at it. All right, let's clock it. Let's get going and here we go. Five on the bid, five on the bid. Derek's got it right now. Which is actually a pretty good deal because if I would have freed those and put them up one at a time, they'd have been $3 loose. So, you know, you're talking $12 in loose cars. Right there, right now, Derek's got the deal for five. Can't beat that, can't beat that. Brian says he tried ordering, but can't. Um, I'm not exactly sure what uh, what you're referring to there, Brian, because uh, once you're registered at diecasttv.com, you just place your bid in uh, on the live program, you just place your bid here, uh, right in the message board. But in the stream store, uh, when the stream store is up and running, you just type in the item number into the chat and then we, we record that down uh, and fill the orders that way. All right then, we are sold, sold, sold here. All right. So Derek with a good little deal there. Man, I cannot believe we could not get a bite on that one, but by golly, let's see if this one does. Check out this Porsche 599, holy crap. Now that's a nice little Porsche right there. That's easily, that's easily a little $5 bit starting bid on that one. Easily a little $5 start on that. Check out that wicked little Ferrari. Man, oh man, is that cool or what? I, uh, yeah, somebody, somebody throw the fire at that so I don't start myself a box tonight. I don't need any more cars. Nice little one there, nice little loose one there. All right. Well, I guess I should run through the backyard here real quick. Let's do that. 
Then we can jump back up to throwing some other goodies up here for you. As we work our way into the late night. All right. So here we go, my friends. It looks like we got a few supers. Uh, a couple extra supers here. Not sure where they come from. I didn't see them till just now, but all right. All right. So here we go. Looks like we got the Pangai Roadster. Nice little super super right there. Good little super tea hunter. We got that one. We got, of course, we have the 65 Ford Galaxy. Now that one's that one's really kind of neat. And then we have the 84 Audi Sports Quattro. This one's pretty cool too. This one's pretty doggone cool also. Check that out now. Is it just me or was this thing at one time like going for over a hundred bucks? Or am I thinking a different one shaped like this? But at one point in time, I remember on Super Saturday, I'm pretty sure it was this one here. It went for well over a hundred. So when I look at that $45 tag on there, I'm thinking, wow. Wow, 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 wow. All right. And then, of course, let's see, what else do we have here? Looks like we got a couple uh, 2006, ooh, 2016 factory sealed mystery cars. This is some good stuff here. It was, that's what I thought, Char. That's what I thought. All right. Here we go. I know I picked it, I picked it up in several other treasure hunts in Georgia in a bundle deal. I had got two, two supers, that was one of them, and five or six regular tea hunts, and I think I paid uh, the the guy at, the, at that flea market I was at there in Georgia said 100 bucks, and I'm like, okay, here. <laughs> here we go, folks. All right, the 2006 mystery car. This, of course, is the customized BW drag bus. This thing is sick. Absolutely sick. Nice chrome, uh, chrome body with the flint. Then of course you got the black and the red flames, the big VW logo right there on top of that thing. And of course it's got the factory sealed 2000, did I say 16? I'm sorry, I meant 2006. There's the factory sealed hologram on that. That is just wicked, wicked cool. Ay, ay, ay. That one there folks is a Picasaurus. Holy nuts. Now this one's really cool. This is probably the coolest dairy delivery I've seen. This is a 2005 mystery car. 2006 mystery car. I don't know why I keep saying 2000. I just can't get nothing right tonight. But anyway, here you go. Check this one out, folks. Man, that is one mean little dairy delivery there. Great little real rider tires. On that one, also the factory sealed emblem or holographic sticker. And that one's a half a Picasaurus on the dairy. We still, of course, have this good little die-cast Supercon 41 Willys Gasser. There we go. Tilt that a little bit. Nice, 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 nice. They only did 3,600 of those. And, of course, there's that one. And what other kind of goodies? I uh, dee 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 dee. Uh, we do have from the weekend of wheels. We have a nice little square body here. Uh, House of Cars. This is an '83 Chevy Silverado. Good little one right there, folks. Nice, 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 nice on the Sylvie, and uh, it's tagged at thirty-five. 35 on that one. I don't know how many of these were. Only 4,992. 4,992. Then, of course, we have uh, the other weekend of wheels here. It's a 73 Chevy Cheyenne Super 10, which this one's pretty cool in itself, although I think they forgot to put the bed on it. But still pretty awesome there, so check that one out. That one there, folks, has got a little $40 ticket on it which is kind of low 
kind of surprisingly so. All right, so let's see, the Supercon Willie's Gasser. This one is actually out of Robert Delaney's collection and we do need 40 for that one, which is cheap because uh, when we got these in many months ago, 45 would have got you laughed off the program. <laughs> these were going for 75, 80 bucks, in some cases uh, more than that. So 40 is an absolute flipping steal on that thing. Then, of course, let's see here. Of course, we do have, uh, I do have the 41 Willys Coop Gasser here also. This is the Chase. Only 550 pieces of this one. Surprise, this one is actually still sitting here because this is the lowest print run of any of the Chases that we had in the last M2 shipment. And uh, I do have the main line to go with that. As you know, and I was doing 65 for the pair, if anybody's interested in the pair. The gasser alone will run you 60, the chase alone. On that one, and then of course, we've got the competition cams, 40, 57 Chevy sedan delivery gasser. And this one right here, folks, will also run you right at 60 bucks, or I'll pair it up with the main line. And I'll make the deal I made last week, 65 bucks. I'll get you both. All right. And then, of course, we still have, of course, we're still sitting on, we still got a few of these left. The 79 Chevy Silverado, the Mongoose Factory Team. Oh, man, this one's nice. That one is pretty doggone cool there. And, of course, behind the gas, uh, behind the square body there, we have another square body. This is the Captain Square Body, Chevy Cheyenne Super 10. Another wicked little beast. Limited to 96, 60. And that one right there, folks. Either one of those two, the, the, team, the Mongoose Factory team or the Captain Square Body, $20 buy it now. Well, I've got a few of those left. Then, of course, we've got this great little guy right here. This is the M2 Chevy 85 Camaro IROC Z. Right there. Now this one, uh, they put the wrong sticker on it apparently because they made few, uh, was it fewer pieces than what the sticker says or was it more pieces than what the sticker says? I think it was fewer. I don't know, I haven't seen this one in a while. This thing was all over the place crazy. All over the place crazy on this thing, folks. Uh, and uh, I would start. I would start at say at twenty. I'd go twenty to start the bidding on that one. All right. So that's just kind of a few things there in the backyard. A few little goodies right there. Uh, let's see here. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's try something else here. I don't know. I really can't believe that that Ferrari did not get a bid. Holy crap. Alright guys, I got a final run here. Nice little final run. Here you go. Hydroplane boat there. Check that out. Crazy critter there. Crazy critter there. Chad, what's up buddy? What's up? Derek, which one, which, uh, which one did you put the 20 on? The Camaro? Are you on that Camaro there, the, the IROC Z? Oh, phew. Guys, I'll do this as a, it is a final run. Final runs I'm supposed to ask five for. But hydroplane, I know not too many people like the boat. So let's just say, let's just say, I don't know, $3 loose. On the, right, gotcha, buddy. I'll get that right back up there. Uh, I'll tell you what I'll do. Let me put this up here on the stand like this because, well, shoot. Because when you see these hydroplane racing boats being hauled, this is kind of how they, 
they're on a on a trailer and they're tilted at that angle <laughs> so that's kind of fun all right so let's get the eye rock up there let's get that eye rock back up here right there right there we got 20 on this little beauty do, 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 do. And all right, let me back that down, back that down. Whoa, here, right there, right there. And let's clock that critter. Here we go. 20 on the bid, 20 on the bid, 20 on the bid. <coughs> all right, Derek's got this one, folks. Nice little $20 bid there on that little beauty. And that is a good one, good one, good one. Bring that camera in. That camera's way, way out. Way out, way out, way out, way out. There we go. Way out, way out. Mm. From the Flintstones. What was the name of that band on the Flintstones that did that? Way out. Was that their band's name, Way Out? I forget. Anyway, we got 20 on the bid here. Derek's going to grab the eye rock. It's going to be sold, sold, sold. Nice little grab there for sure. All right, so we'll go back over here and I'll pull that loose one. And I'll try a different loose one here. Here is a nice little final run there, folks. There you go there, there you go there. There you go there. Final run, I'll start it at five, who to bid? Do the bid, do the bid, do the bid, do the give me the five. What do you say? What do you say? What do you say? Oh, boy. All right. So I got that there. I'm back up front here, folks. I have a 2004 first edition. Mitsubishi Eclipse. Now, folks, I believe this to be a Zamic. The reason I say that is, is because, folks, this thing is bare metal. Either that, or they just forgot to paint it, except for the black. But there you go, 2004 first edition Mitsubishi Eclipse. Pretty doggone slick little piece right there. Pretty cool little piece there. Check it out, folks. Check it out, check it out, check it out. Nice one here. All right, uh, I got, I've got a five from Derek here. Five from Derek, but I'm not sure if it's on the Mitsubishi or if it's on the Bronco. Blazer, Bronco, final run piece over there. What I will do is I will start the clock here. All right, I'll let, I'll let him tell me as we go here, but I'll, I'm gonna guess it's this one. This one is kind of cool, it is different. But either way, either way, if it's on this one or the Bronco, either one, here we go. The darn message only showed up on my phone because I've got my phone open to Twitch. We've got the YouTube feed, we've got, of course, the real stream feed, going on Ollie, so he is on the Bronco. All right, so here we go, folks. It's actually on the Bronco here, on the Bronchio. That's a good deal. That is a pretty doggone good deal there. On the Bronco. Alex is testing YouTube. Here we go, folks, and that is sold, sold, sold. All right, another final run. Look at this beauty. Look at this beauty. Nice little final run piece right there. 
What do you say there, folks? Man, oh man, oh man. Jump on that one. That's one of the cool, the cool, the final runs. Oh, holy crap. A cop rod? Seriously? I think that's what that is. It's a real rider, nonetheless. Storm in there now. That sucks. We had, some, we had, I came through a pretty good uh, windy thunderstorm on my way here late this afternoon. But uh, made a little stop at a little out of the way uh, store and uh, I found the complete set of the car culture uh, that has the uh, Nissan, that has the, uh, the, 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 the trucks and the uh, Mercedes. I thought I'd never see those sets. They just, you know, never ever show up on the peg, at least not at my stores locally. And, uh, but by golly, in the last two days, I finally got a set of them and a couple extras of the trucks. But I did leave at least one for each one that I took. So, yeah. So I didn't, I didn't leave, I didn't leave the pegs bare. I was being nice for a change. I don't know, but anyway. All right, so nobody on that, and nobody on this one. This surprises me. I thought for sure somebody would jump on that one. Still haven't seen him there. Man, I don't know. It's it's weird because um, I don't know if anybody here is on the Hot Wheels Hoarder site, but the guys have literally got hundreds of these things that they've found. Literally, they just go in and grab the cases and run out the door with them. So I don't know, man. It's just weird. Just weird, just weird. All right. All righty. Well, uh, let's see. I'm not going to put for another Ferrari up there. Let's just skip that. <laughs> let's skip that. No more Ferraris right now. Unless somebody says, hey, you got any Ferraris? <laughs> and then we'll talk about it. Uh, let's see. I'll tell you what. Let's do a little three for five. Why not? Let me put up three. Let's put three cards up front here. We'll start the bidding at five. Cards may not, some of these cards will have issues, folks, all right? Just so you know. But uh, the alternative is, is that I free them and put them up as three dollar loose. Where in which case here, you can grab three, you know, three of them starting bid five bucks. We'll start out with this little 57 Chevy. Cool little burger there. I have an Auburn 852. And I have the Swing Fire. As you can see, the Swing Fire, of course, has, does have a vein. Or, yeah, it's a crease. It's all the way through. It's, not, it's no longer a vein. It's a crease. So check it out here, folks. All right, so all three of these right here, five bucks will be the start. We'll start it at five and we'll see what happens here on the three. Now, of course, now the cameras are all goofy, goofy, goofy. Do, 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 do. There we go, there we go, there we go, and there we go. Yeah, no, really haven't. Really haven't been grabbits in a long time there, Alex. Yeah, I, I, I will tell you, you know, the main thing is, is that they're, uh, they're a, uh, I will tell you that for these, um, I'm more comfortable doing these on three for fives than I am, you know, $3 grabbits, uh, mainly because just of card conditioning, but uh, either way, either way, it's a deal here, it is a deal, I've got Daddy Magic uh, starting starting us off with a five here. Derek comes in with a five, but right now it is Daddy Magic with five. Daddy Magic with five on the bid. Daddy Magic's got the deal at five here. I had five from him first, then Derek followed up with a five. Right now it is Daddy Magics. All right, 
here we go, 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 here we go. And here we go. Five is the bid. Five is the bid. Daddy Magic's got the deal right now. Derek goes seven. We now have seven on the bid. All right, so now Derek's reset the clock and got the deal at seven. it up to eight there we got eight on the bid there and folks I have a I do believe a cop rod is that if I'm not mistaken real rider here check that out five bucks will start the bidding on that one but right now we're up here on this little critter right here right here daddy magic's got the deal at eight daddy magic has the dealio at avio Here we go, here we go, here we go. Counting it out, counting it out, counting it out, counting it out. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Eight is the bid. Eight is the bid. And I don't know if he can hear me or what, but I've called it out. I don't know how many times. That is sold, sold, sold. And Daddy Magic's got it for eight. All right, guys, over here, check it out. I need five to start on this one. Five dollars to start on that one. Nice little real rider. Nice little real rider there. Check it out, folks. Check it out, check it out. Looking for five, looking for five, looking for a five. And Pork's gonna go five, and let's clock that sucker, by golly. Let's clock that sucker. Pork in the house, what's up there, dude? Five on the bid, pork got it. Nice, 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 and nice. over here and I'll get some more first time on in over three weeks you move back to Ohio dude back to back to OHIO work back up there in Ohio check it out check it out and check it out here we go folks here we go here we go here here we go here that is sold 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 pork with the deal here Switch that out. I have a final run. Lamborghini. Oh man, that is the final run Lambo. Who will start the bidding on, on that one? Just give me five. Looking for five. Looking for a five. And we'll get that one going. So you know that one's there. So let's go. Yeah, I tell you. Uh, Alex has got it made, man. I mean, literally. Literally, literally, literally. He can, he can throw a rock and hit the front stretch of the speedway from his uh, from his uh, front yard there so to speak man oh man oh man all right so folks up front here up front ladies and gentlemen I have a hot one here and this one's pretty cool this is the Corvette from the hot one series Corvette Stingray all right let me try to go through here slightly slow. And all right, so I 
I've got I've got a no problem there. I've got the we got boss grabbing one of the captain square bodies. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. You write that down here. And do we have the kernel version? Not exactly. Not exactly. My kernel status may be up in the air. Still waiting, still waiting, still waiting. All right, so I've got the Captain Square body. We've got boss on that one. And, and anybody else is interested in this one, folks? We've got a few of these left. They are 20 bucks a pop on that one right there. And that's a buy it now price. That is a buy it now price right there. All right, folks, on this one right here, now this one is tagged. This one is tagged at 25, all right? Um, there's a couple, there's a little, there's, there's some creasing. There's a little creasing around the, around the, as you can see right there, around the, hip, the hook area, all right? So 15 will start this one. I will start this one at 15 and we'll see what goes there. You think the kernel is green? Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I've not seen that one yet, but who knows? All right, folks, here we go here. Here we go here. Here we go here, ladies and gentlemen. Check it out, folks. Check it out. Beauty, 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 and beauty. Folks, here we go. Yeah, the mop. Uh, not seeing the mongoose now. The snake one. Yeah, we got. Yeah, the team. Yeah, the mongoose one. Yeah, that's a good one, man. That one is good. 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 It's sweet. All right. So here we go, folks. Here we go. Here. Here we go. Here. That thing moved on its own. That's scary. All right. Well, I'll tell you what we'll do here. I'll pop that one out, and we'll go with a nice little. Oh my goodness! Check out the tail dragger here from the Red Line series. I'll tell you what here, three dollar loose. Three dollar loose on that one. Just type in loo the loose, the loose, the loose, loose. And you can have that critter. Alright, here we go. I have a ramp truck. From the Pearl Driver series, we have the Talbot Lago. I'm sure I pronounced that so totally freaking wrong. Uh, well, let's see. Yeah, I'm still I'm still suffering with uh, Daytona uh, withdrawal symptoms, and I have a nice little Porsche 959, 959. There, check it out, check it out, check it out. Char says I'm just excited. I was not yelling. Oh, well. <laughs> oh goodness gracious, goodness gracious. I tell you. It's, uh, texting is, typing messages is interesting because half the time, half the time, yeah. All you got to do is put the wrong, the wrong pronunciation mark or something on the, on the darn thing. And the next thing you know, somebody thinks you're yelling at them or something. All right, folks, here we go. $3, uh, $5 to start all three. Five bucks to start all three. Ooh, I got some good loose ones here. So we'll run, we'll run back and forth, around and around and around we go. All right. Nobody for the loose one. Uh, good question, Alex. Hang on, buddy. Let me look. That is from that. It, that was released in 1999. 1999. Now the card is pretty rough there, buddy. I, like I said, that's why I'm putting these up at three for five. Three of them at five. Card, cards are uh, seen better days. As you can see there, there's a little bit of creasing and stuff on that one, but uh, still a nice piece there. All right, so there we go, folks. There we go, there we go, there. All right, and all right, and all right. 
Let me grab my box of craziness here. Ooh. Uh oh, is this what I think it is? Is this what I think it is? <laughs> Derek is giving us a five on the bid, so here we go, here we go. Five here, five here. Alex goes five, but Derek actually put in five first there, but I got Alex in there at five as well. But Derek's got the deal right now. Derek actually has the deal right now at five bucks. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go, here we go, here we go. Five on the bid, five on the bid. Five on the bid, Derek's got it. 18 seconds left on the clock. And that is sold, sold, sold. Derek grabbed that one. All right. All right, folks, over here, we're going to take a little trip down to Dub City. 57, um, I can't remember what it was now. 57 Buick Century. Check it out, folks. Nice piece right there. $5 to start. $5 to kick that one into underdrive, overdrive, and around the drive. So check it out, folks. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Little $5 start on the Jada. Just looking for a five, looking for five. Oh, ho, ho, ho. this one will be fun. This one will be fun. I laugh because man, oh man, oh man. I can definitely get more out of these if I free them and make them loose. Just saying, I got five on the bid here, so let's kick it. We'll kick it here, kick it here. Oh man, oh man, oh man. Oh, holy guacamole and monkey sauce. I got some good stuff coming up here in a minute. Well, I mean good in the sense that it's definitely something different. Shara's got the deal right here. Five on this one. Great little Jada here. Great little Jada here. So, guys, what do you think of the new M2 line, that's, uh, the new muscle machine lines that are out? Alex posted a photo earlier of the hauler with the car. I've seen a couple of them over the weekend uh, in Naples. I was in, I was in, uh, yes, I was in Naples yesterday. And, uh, Stopped at Hobby Lobby there in Naples and saw a couple of the new ones. Didn't buy them, but man, they are cool. And Shara's got this one. All right. All right, guys. Here comes some fun. I have the TV series Batmobile textured grill, but guys, it's on the faster than ever wheels. Now the last two times I've had these, these sold for $20. The, the Batmobile, I don't know what it is about the Batmobile on the faster than ever wheels. It's nuts. It is nuts. It is nuts. Yeah, most certainly. I agree. I agree there. I definitely agree, boss. Let me tell you. All right, folks. I'm going to start this at five. Uh, Batman original TV series Batmobile on the faster than ever wheels. That ain't nothing. 
That ain't nothing. <laughs> ain't. So we got that one there. Felon's gonna throw the five at it. All right, here we go. Let's clock that sucker. Felon says, yeah, clock that. Hurry up and clock that before they realize what the hell you just put up there, dude. Clock that sucker. It is clocked. Faster than ever wheels. Beautiful piece. Ooh. Man, oh man, oh man. Crazy good cars in here tonight. Crazy good cars in here tonight. Right now I've got five on the bid here. Felon's got the deal. Felon's got the deal here at five. Amazing little piece. Amazing little piece right there. I tell you, I don't know what's going on at Target and Walmart right now, but all they're getting in is the Halloween cars, this um, the, with the sugar skulls and that kind of stuff. Six on the bid. Six come in. Thomas throws a six. Thomas comes in with a six. I couldn't believe it, man. Oh man, I'm like, oh come on. You finally get Hot Wheels and it's all that little five or six car set of Halloween cars. I'm like, and they're not even good Halloween cars either, really. I think of better cars, you know, a couple of them that they've, a couple of them they could have done better with. Felon goes seven, Felon says, ah, now wait a minute, this is a good one, I can't let it go. Felon says, I can't let it go, can't let it go, can't let it go. Can't let it go. Halloween UPC cars are the same. Man, oh man, oh man. That stinks. But that's all right. That's all right. Kept me from spending more money than I did, so. <laughs> uh, but at least I got the car culture sets. At least I got a set of those, so. The card design, the card design on those things is stellar. It's definitely one of the be better looking uh, ones that they've done in a while on a lot of these crazy sets. So yeah, that's pretty cool, man. It is. And that is sold, sold, sold. So Felon grabs this one. Uh, and Thomas came in after the clock there, doggone it. But, all right. So let's jump up front here. Let's jump up front because like I said, this is gonna, this is gonna be fun. This is gonna be kind of fun because I have, on the faster than ever wheels, card, cards a little rough in places. We have the Myers Manx. Little FTE action going on there. I have the Steel Flame. Also, on the Faster Than Ever wheels. Uh oh. So check it out there. And then, oh man, I should put this one up separately, but oh well. 64 Chevy Impala, Faster Than Ever wheels. This one is wicked. Check it out, my friends. Here we go. Here we go. Three FTEs. Cards are less than perfect. Like I said, I could, I should probably have freed them and just put them up and auctioned them off on the loose side. But you know what? Let's go here. Who will give me five to start this one? Now that doesn't surprise me. They're out. They're out to get us any way they can get us. And that's gonna hurt because, <laughs> oh man, that's gonna hurt a lot of a lot of online sellers. Here we go. Support gives me a five. I got five on the bid here, folks. Five on the bid. Holy cow! Three nice FTEs. Three nice faster than ever's here. Man, oh man, oh man. Here we go. 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 Right now. I've got Pork at five, Felon throws a five, and Derek throws a five, but right now Pork was in first with the five. 
Oh, they're going to get us no matter how, how you look at it. How you look at it there. We knew, it, we knew it wouldn't be long before the government got into, you know, decided that, hey, wait a minute, we're missing out. We're missing out here. PayPal is making all this money. We need it. We need our cut of it. Here we go, folks. We got 10 seconds left, and I've got five on the bid right now from pork. Felon threw a five. Derek threw a five. Daddy Magic threw a five. But right now, it's all pork. Pork's got it at five. And that is sold, sold, sold. And I cannot believe that. I cannot believe that. Man, oh man, oh man, and oh man. Cannot believe pork just stole. Good deal here, buddy. Good, I shouldn't say stole. Good deal. Definitely a good deal on those. All right. Alrighty, guys. Alright. I've got one here somewhere. I've got to find it. Got to find it. Got oh, you know what? Let's put this one up here. Check this wicked little beast out over here, folks. Holy crap. Holy crap. Holy crap. Wicked little black wall here. Wicked little black wall here. This is the stage fright. This is a Hong Kong base. Guys, I need 10 to start this one. 10 to start this one. 10 to start it. Uh, no, it was not a winner's choice. It was one money take all. One money take all. Now, I, I would have done a winner's choice if the cards were perfect, guys, but the cards are far from it. And I'm just not comfortable doing it, doing it that way. Like I said, I could free these and run them as loose. All right, guys. So check it out here. Check it out here. Alex gives me a ten. Alex gives me a ten on this one. This is a cool little piece right there. I got Alex at ten. Alex at ten. Alex at a 10. All right, check it out, folks. Check it out, check it out, and check it out. Alex on this one. Uh, no, uh, no stock car legends that I know of. I've been working through some of the racing stuff in the back, and uh, I'm not seeing any. We've not we've not had any of those in a few weeks, actually. Uh, we had we had a bunch of them, but man, uh, Epic and uh, a couple other guys went on a tear with Rick several weeks ago on those, and I mean we flat out sold them out. And we've not found any more yet, but we're always looking. And Alex picks this one up. Good grab there, definitely. Good grab there, without a doubt, man. Without a doubt. That, that's pretty clean, too. That's what's amazing. This thing is awful clean, awful nice looking. All right, here's a GMC mode at home. Well, eh, a little on the relatively clean. It's just a little dingy looking. Probably just needs a nice little bath. You know, just don't soak the axles because they're rust. You'll get rust around your wheel wells. But uh, check it out there, folks. That's a nice little one there. Start me at five. Start me at five on that one. How about it? Who'd have been five? 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 All right, folks. Let's jump back up front here. Let's try. Let's try a few more FTEs here. We have the Dodge Viper GTSR. Once again, guys, just so you know, 
don't expect perfect cards here because these aren't. That's why you're seeing these up here. Three, three at a time, one money takes all. 2001 Mini Cooper. Also on, as you can see, great little FTE piece there. And then, of course, uh-oh, how about a little uh, 69 Pontiac Firebird? on some faster than ever wheels. Another good piece right there. All right guys, so check these out here, man. One money takes all here. One money will take all there, check them out. Good one, good one, gooder one. Gooter one, good one, nice one. Yeah, all, all, those, all those ones in the, as I say there. Check it out, check it out, check it out, check it out, check it out. Uh, Nicholas, I have, I, I really don't know, buddy. I don't have anything to do with the shipping, but uh, I know Glue was in here on Monday uh, when nobody else was, and he was getting things packed and ready to go. Uh, I know some stuff went out today. I don't know what, though, but uh, I know he is working on all paid invoices and getting those, uh, getting those out the door. So, uh, so hopefully, sir, hopefully, hopefully, hopefully they're on the way. Uh, usually when, once they're scanned, the tracking information does show up on the PayPal, uh, the pay, on the invoice. It's automatically, it automatically fits, feeds it into the invoice there. I've got five on the bid here, folks. I got Derek at five, so just keep, just keep checking back there and it should show you. Uh, any specific questions or related to shipping, do direct it directly to uh, Rick or Ross. Message us on Diecast TV there. And we'll take care of you, my friend. Yeah, definitely. Definitely, definitely, definitely. There it would be a tad slow, but uh, anyway, here we go, folks. Five is the bid here. I don't know why that's. Oh, that's right, because I didn't reset it. Oops. Five is the bid here, folks. Five is the bid. Five is the bid. Derek's got the deal. Right now, Derek's going to take all three for five. All right now. It's going to be so, so, so. All right. Another good grab. Another good grab. All right, so let me pop that motor home out of there. And let's go with the, ooh. Hong Kong, Hong Kong base here, it's a gold base. It's got your black walls. I'm not sure about this one, folks, but check it out. A little teetotaler. Nice little piece here, folks. It is on a Hong Kong base. Check it out there, my friends. I know this, uh, I know where I should be on this, but I know where I'll start it. So uh, here we go. What do you say here, my friends? How about, it is a nice little black wall there. Let's start at five and see if we can get a little auction action going here. We can get a little action in the auction. Not a problem, Nicholas. Not a problem there, buddy. Alex is in a five, and let's go, 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 go. It's nice. It is. It is. It is. You're absolutely right there. Absolutely right, David. It is nice and clean, my friend. It is very nice and clean. Uh, anybody that follows racing find it ironic that after all the all the BS that Two Finger got himself supposedly into that's been hushed hushed here now lately that he manages to win Saturday night or Sunday night man oh man oh man what a complete mess that race turned out to be although by golly got a Got a hint to Larson, man. He's definitely going for it. He threw that thing into four and didn't lift and rode the wall and dang near won it. I think had it been anybody else other than Larson, 
Hamlin would have found himself spun out. I don't think they would have lifted. Alright. Gotcha, Alex, on this one. Well, I'll tell you what, folks. Oh, now this is this is from the vintage collection. Alright, so this is a re-release of the Red Baron. Only this one is a little on the brown side there. Check it out. We'll start that one at five. We'll definitely start that one at five. Yeah, I know, right? Char says she's calling Blaney to win the championship. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I think Larson's definitely going to be tough to beat there. Chase, oh my gosh, Chase is in a hole right now, but uh, not counting Chase out either. You know, he performed, he, you know, everything was just, everything was just totally fudged up. Totally fudged up. It was just a, that was just a screwed up race. Blaney managed to finish it after all of his problems. Yeah, Harvick, yeah, Harvick was, you know, Harvick ran solid. Ah. Uh, I'm going to tell you guys, I don't know. I don't know. I think it's all up in the air there. The only thing I know for certain is, is that we know Hamlin is definitely in the next round. Yeah. But anyway. But, like I say, I like Larson's attitude right now. He's going to, he's going to leave it all on the track. So, I don't know. That may not bode well for others. We got five from Alex here. Five on the bid, five on the bid. Five on the bid there. I don't know. But you never know though, right? You never know. Weirder things have happened and the next thing you know, uh, 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 uh oh, I can't think of his name now. Ruh -roh. Uh, the dude that won the Daytona 500. I'm drawing a blank. You know, haven't heard much out of him the rest of the season, but uh, you know, he's not a bad short track racer. You never know. Stranger things have happened. That's who. I wouldn't count. Yeah, definitely don't count. Kurt. Don't overlook Kurt right now. Don't overlook, overlook Kurt. But I'll tell you what, man. I'm happy to see Chastain running like he is. <laughs> right? Oh, man. Oh, man. I, uh, yeah, that would have started World War III, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it, wouldn't it, wouldn't it? Man, oh man. Alex grabs another nice one here. All right. Boy, did you see those uh, see those guys jump when Kyle decided to bowl down, go uh, go to the garage through a, a road that was piloned off when he decided to take out the pylons? <laughs> Woo, he made people jump. Man, oh man, oh man. All right, where's it at? Oh, uh, come on, dum-dum. I've got some other pretty cool ones here, folks, and i got to find it. Got to make sure I get my hands on the right one here because I do want to get it up here before I forget I even have it. Well, while I'm looking for it, let me give you this final run. Nice little final run right here, folks. Nice little final run right there. Check it out. There, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, here it is. Now, first and foremost, I did not know that at one point in time, I, I've seen I've seen cars with dogs in the back windows before the station wagons. I had no idea that they did it on a uh, Mercedes 380 SEL. Patrick's gonna go five on that one. All right, clock is hot. Clock is hot. Clock is hot. Good little final run right there. 
Nice little loose finally final run. All right, guys, let me grab you another, another crazy. Let's see what else I got here. I can give you for three for fives. It's just downright insane. Yeah, I'll throw one of those in there just for fun. So what's going on here? What's going on? What's going on? <laughs> that okay, the dog doesn't bite. That's right, that's right, that's right. Here we go, folks. Five is the bid here. Five is the bid. Patrick's got the deal. Three, two, one, and see old, old, old. All right. Good one there. All right, folks, here we go. This is the Mercedes 380 SL Hong Kong base. Gold rims, black wall tires, and... Oh, a little putty dog in the back window right there. The side, the driver's side rear. Little putty dog in the back there. I thought I taught a putty dog. Check it out. Check it out. Man, oh man, man. Now I know, I know, and you know that this isn't exactly a a lightweight uh, car cost wise, right? It is a little rough, folks. I will I will take a $5 bid on it. I will take a $5 start on that thing and we'll run it. I will run it. Let me get a couple just some regular like little loose grabs coming up here. All right, folks, check that one out. Neat, 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 neat. All right. So let's jump back up front here, folks. I have, a, I have a blue card brown back. Not in the card's got some issues, but it is a Solaire CX-4. I have on the faster than ever wheels, I have a Cadillac 16. And I have a Unical tank truck. All right, so here we go here, folks. Uh, $5 will start it. $5 will get you going on, whoop, on that one right there. So what do you say, what do you say? I will pull that loose one and we'll get a different loose one up here because I got some other pretty cool loose ones. <laughs> this one's kind of fun. Uh oh, wait a minute, there's something. Uh, I bet you that head bugs Bunny's head in it. Well, poop. All right, all right, all right. So, I think this is actually missing something. Looney Tunes Racing, Bugs Bunny. But uh, I think, folks, if I'm not mistaken, was Bugs Bunny's head attached to that at one time? Because there's a hole in the windshield there. So I think Bugs Bunny's head must have been in there. $3 loose, guys. If anybody wants it, $3 loose. $3 loose, $3 loose. Just type in loose on that one. Uh, you guys are on the Mercedes with the dog in the back? Oh, on the trio, the trio. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. All right. So let's jump back up front here. Five on the bid here. I've got Patrick at five, Derek at five. Patrick was in with the five first. So here we go. Let's get her, get her, get her. All right, Patrick's got the deal right now. Boy, and speaking of a duo, holy crap. Yep, that Unical is a pretty cool tank truck there. All right, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Five seconds left. And Patrick's got the deal. Sold, sold, sold. All 
All right, guys, so let me, let's switch that one out, folks. Here's a pretty cool little matchbox. It's a Group C racer. Champion spark plugs. Check it out here, folks. Check that crazy critter out on the matchbox. Um, I'll tell you what I'll do here, folks. Tell you what we'll do, tell you what we'll do here on this little critter. All right, man, that's a cool piece. It really is a cool piece there, guys. Um, and let's see, first person to, uh, I've already got somebody typing loose, so, <laughs> all right, so Derek has typed loose there on that, so all right, we got it. Got it, got it, got it. I was just gonna say $3 loose there. We got Patrick on the other. So let me get that taken care of. All right, guys, check this one out. Now this one we're gonna have to do a little something on. I have Atomica 1976 Tommy Mercedes Benz 450 SEL number F7. This thing is clean, ladies and gentlemen. Very very clean here. This will be a $10 start. We need a $10 start on that one. Uh, things, that thing's valued at around 20 plus. I will start it at 10. That thing is pretty doggone clean there. grins and giggles of course just for grins and giggles as you can see four factory sealed sets 2010 2006 2009 2008 the 2008 is still in the box it shipped in has not been open so it's still it's so the set itself is actually inside of two boxes the shipping box and the box that was on the box cover in the box and the shipping box. <laughs> I, I know. Ugh. Anyway, uh, now I will tell you that uh, uh, they want a uh, thousand for the 2010 set. It is numbered 50 of 500. Uh, the 2006, 2008, and 2009 sets, $750 each. But they did say. They did say $3,000 and you can have all four. I know, that's a lot. It's a lot, but I've also heard, I also heard it said that open invoice. So if you want just one, grab it, we'll open the invoice and boom, you know, make your payments and boom, have that set in your hands before you know it. Um, if you want all four, we'll work with you. Uh, there they are, there they are. All right, so enough of that. Enough of teasing you with those. I know they're right there. If anybody wants any one of them or all of them, let me know there. All right, folks. Johnny Lightning Mopar Madness piece is here. Limited edition of 2,500. These things just keep popping up. I have, if they, they've got, apparently they must have a bunch of these stashed somewhere. They must have the entire print run. I don't know, but check it out. Here's your red one. Limited to one of 2,500. There's your red Cuda. And here's the purple Cuda. Check them out, my friends. Check them out. Check them out. And check them out. Both of them. I don't know. These things are like a bad penny. They keep turning up keep turning up 
All right, I'll tell you what we'll do here, folks. I'll tell you what we'll do here with these. I'll tell you what we'll do here with these. I will start the pair. Uh, we'll go 20 for the pair. Sometimes they, these things keep coming back. Uh, beats the heck out of me. I don't know where, where they come from. I don't know, Rick must have them. I don't know, are they hidden in it? I have no idea. I have no idea. I was looking on the cart and there they are and I'm like, are you flipping kidding me? Crazy, crazy, crazy. I wouldn't be surprised. I can, <laughs> I can say I, I really wouldn't be surprised there. All right, folks, here we go. All right, Mike, how many times have you listened to the new Maiden release? All right, guys, let me, uh, I'll do winner's choice at 10 or 20 for the pair on that. All right. I, it's been sold out in my area, Mike. So far, I got the Walmart uh, CD version. Still working, still looking for the album itself. Um, and then, of course, you know, I got it downloaded as well. Uh, so I had it <laughs> at midnight. I get the notification. It is ready. You know, it, it is. I like it better than the last one. I like it better than the last one. It's. Um, Especially uh, the middle, middle few songs, and then the very the song at the very end. It's really, really good piece. Really like listening to it. Hoping for a tour before too much longer here, as they usually started out in Fort Lauderdale. Uh, and you know the drummer has uh, Nico has a restaurant right there in Fort Lauderdale. Uh, and it's actually a nice little, it's just a nice little burger and fry kind of place. You know, great barbecue. Holy crap. Man, rock and roll ribs. Good little restaurant down there in Fort Myer, or Fort Lauderdale. And uh, everyone, and he's in there quite often. And so are a couple of the other members of Maiden. I've just never been in there at the right time. On that. All right, folks. So here we go here. All right, so let's jump over here. Um. Uh, Tell you what, folks, $3 loose, nice little matchbox here. We'll just do a little $3 loose. A little $3 loose. $3 loose. Loose, 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 loose. I'm surprised Bruce's voice is holding up, you know? I mean, the guy's been through, he's had, he had tongue cancer. He, you know, he's 70 years old. I mean, you know. I mean, holy crap, you know, these guys are still kicking it. Still kicking it. But, um, I don't know. For me, for me, I wish they would go back to the two guitar. I mean, I understand why they kept the other, other uh, why they kept Yannick, but, um, I, I just could not get into his style of playing. It just really didn't fit with Maiden's, you know, sound. But uh, I, I get why they, I, I mean, I understand it, but, uh, you know. I'm sorry, but, um, you know, Dave and Adrian, though, man, oh, man. Killer duo. All right, folks, just type in loose here, and you can grab it. Type in loose, loose, loose. Nobody for that one? Well, then I guess I probably shouldn't put the Croc Zoo Park Patrol one up there, neither, should I? I got that one also, just in case. Just in case, just in case. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Interesting combination there. Interesting combination. That that riff between KK and uh, and Priest is uh, hoo hoo hoo. Yeah. 
Man, oh man, oh my brother. You know, Ripper, Ripper, I'll tell you what, Ripper's got the pipes, man. He can do it. He can definitely do it. All right, nobody on that one, all right. Here we go, folks. Oh, check this out. Mummified. Nice little demon. Nice little demon there. What do you say? Uh, $3 loose. $3 loose. $3 loose. $3 loose. Hey, Mike, what do you know about Darda motor cars? They have an interesting little Darda piece here. Apparently, it was, must have been a pull back and go or something like that. Or I don't know. I don't know. It's an interesting piece, though. Really interesting piece here. If it is a pull back and go, it no longer works. I don't know, though, but I could be wrong. Maybe it's not pull back and go. Maybe there's something else to it. I just don't know. He's like, huh? I don't know. Well, I'll show you. I'll show you. I'll show you. I'll show you. All right, let me show you the base. I believe it's Darda. D A D R. Darda. Da -de -da -da. Right there. Check it out. If you look through the back window, you see some gears and stuff in there, but it doesn't, you know, if, it, if it's pulled back and go, it doesn't pull back and go anymore. I don't know. Interesting little piece. It's got real rider tires. I thought it, I thought it might have been a slot car, but the bottom's not put together right for it to be a slot car. So this is kind of an enigma to me. I'm not exactly sure what I'm looking at. I guess I could have took a little more time and looked it up, but eh, nah. Check it out, check it out, check it out. Alex says it's a Plymouth Aries, okay. Well, at least we got that much. <laughs> yeah, I don't know either, man. I don't know either, I don't know either. Man, oh man, oh man. Now, uh, let's see, Boss thinks it might be a Reliant K. Uh, Alex is saying it's a Plymouth Aries. I don't know, either way, it's kind of neat. It is kind of neat, but uh, the motor apparently, you may have to get in there and uh, work on it. So, because yeah, it doesn't do anything at all. I wish it did. It's meant to be fun. You know, it, it has the, you know, here's the thing. It's made in, made in West Germany. Now, if you look at the nose, it looks like it has that Mercedes M on. It's the circle and the three point. You look at the nose, it has the circle and the three points. So, I don't know. But anyway, check it out. Check it out, folks. Real Rider. This could be worth, you know, it could be worth nothing. It could be worth $100 million. Alright, uh, so let's start it at five. <laughs> let's start it at five if anybody wants it. Anybody wants that critter? Then I got a really cool corgi. Really cool corgi coming up here. Definitely Mercedes because I'm holding a Mercedes in my hand and the emblem is correct. So check it out there, folks. Interesting piece to say the least. More than likely so. Country of origin is West Germany. So anyway, all right. Well, let me pop that one out of here, folks. I just thought it was kind of cool and different. It might have just been unique enough to be weird. I have a Corgi, Mercedes-Benz 300 SL. Check this crazy critter out. Look at this, man, ay, 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 this is cool. Cool, 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 cool. One, for the fact that these doors are still on this thing and still function. All right, man, oh man, oh man, look at that. I mean, these things are set, it's just, whew. That is just sweet as sweet can be there, guys. What do you say? What do you say? Give me a bid on the corgi. Give me a bid on the cor or orgy. C -c -c corgi. C -c -c corgi. Ch -ch 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 
Check it out there, folks. Check it out. We will auction that one off. As you know, Corgi pieces aren't exactly inexpensive, uh, especially older ones. Hey, check this out. From Maisto, I have the Urban Diecast Collection Ride Series. I have a 37 Ford Coupe. 37 Ford Coupe. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out, folks. Nice little piece right here. That thing is neat, 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 neat. All right, right there. Let me go back to the... Let me, I just wanted to give you the wide shot so you can see there. And here we go. I've got five on the bid here. Five on the bid, five on the bid. Alex is giving me a five on the Corgi. So let's jump back over here. Jump back over here to the Corgi and let's go. Five is the bid. Five is the bid. Five on that one, five on that one, five on that one. All right, my friends, Alex has got the deal. <sighs> I don't know if this is its original color or not. So since I don't know, and I see a lot of overspray, I'm going to assume that it's not. So that one's going to hide away for now. And I'm going to go with something else. Now I got Alex at five. Sold, sold, sold. All right. Oops. All right, guys. Anybody interested in the 37 Ford Coupe there? Maisto, Urban Diecast. Pretty sweet little piece right there. All right, guys, a nice little baby Ruth uh, Pro tr uh, Drag Racing uh, truck, whatever you want to call it there. Check it out, folks. $3 loose. $3 loose. Just type in loose and you can have that crazy little critter. So what do you say there, my friends? Good stuff, good stuff. All right, let me grab some other goodies here. Let's see what kind of insane things I can put up here yet tonight. Ooh. Dang, that's a, that's a killer Tacoma, Pikes Peak Tacoma here. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go, and here we go. Uh, Alex got the coupe for five. Or the loose one I had it prior to this one, Alex actually had, had it for five. I was like pork scrabbing this one, okay. says the one before the corgi the tomica the tomica i had up there what one did that what one was the, what one did i have before the corgi oh one of the one of the broncos right One of the which boy which one of these there? Two different ones there, right? Right, right? I think that's what I had, and then I put up the 
put it. I don't know. I'm moving through too many cars here. I probably set it down somewhere. Let me know which one it was then and we'll, we'll go with it, alright? So the darter cars are our pull back and release cars. I just had some information sent to me on them. German design and engineered precision clutch motor can't be overwound. Well, apparently it must have been overwound because the darn thing doesn't work. But anyway, so there we go. There we go, there we go, and there we go. Oops, all right, let me get everything back up here because right, there we go. All right, guys. All right, let me pull, set these to the side because I have another Mercedes here. But now this one is by the. And it, it's a little bit rougher shape, folks. It is a little bit rougher shape. Uh, all right, got gotcha you on that. Uh, now this is that. This is that company that has that. Um, it's a circle with a Z and then some small writing to the side of the Z. Right there, all right? Check it out though, folks. It's a little rough. It is a little on the rough side there. Oh, that one, that one, I, when I was, I, it wasn't, it wasn't a loose grab, I was needing a bid on it. Needing a bid on the Darda. This one right here, that one right there, I was looking for a bid. It was going to start it at five. This one off of Ross. Uh, guys, this one, this one should not have been put up for sale. Yeah, th this one right here should not have been put up for sale. Uh, I think that was grabbed off of Ross's desk. Uh, I know because I picked that up and brought it in for him. That dinky, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that one should not have been put up. That's going back on Loss's desk before he realizes it's missing. Yeah, that one that one shouldn't have been put up there. Whew. Boy oh boy, that could have been sad. Alright guys, alright, check this out. Check this out, check this out. I know, right? Alright, check this out folks. I'll tell you now here's the thing with this one. I've got a couple others that are in much better condition. Alright. Uh, and they are both gonna have to be a minimum of 15. This one right here though, this one right here, it's a little rougher shape as you can see. Definitely a little rougher shape. Start me at 10 on this one. Start me at 10 on that one. 
And then let's jump up front over here, guys, because I'm gonna throw I'm gonna throw something else at you here. I have a Camaro Wind. Uh, I, I, this is one of those castings you either like or you hate. I can, I like the casting. I think it's kind of neat. Very soft corner. I have a Toyota MR2. Cards, yeah, you know, the card is, you know, as you can see, the card's got a couple issues as well. Nice little Toyota though. And then on the faster than ever wheels though, check out this wicked little beast. Check out this Pikes Peak Celica. Man, this thing is about as cool as it gets in that particular cat. Uh, Tacoma, I'm sorry. Pikes Peak Tacoma. Check it out, folks. Holy cow. Holy cow and holy cow. Boom, boom, boom. Man, oh man, oh man. What do you say there? What do you say? What do you say? What do you say? I'll start it at five. I'll start it at five. No, they're not. Dinkies are not cheap. Not by any stretch of the imagination. All right, so let me get caught up here. So I got Patrick come in with the five. No, wait a minute. Wait, 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 no. And I got Derek at five. Derek at five, Patrick at five. All right, so here we go, five is the bid, five is the bid. We've got Derek right now with five. Man, if we don't get this thing straightened out, I'm gonna go nuts. Here, right here, I see Derek, and then those dinkies aren't cheap. And then Patrick came in with five, Doobie came in with five. So here we go, here we go, here we go. Right now, Derek's got the deal. Doobie goes six. Doobie goes six on the three P three pack attack here. Here we go, here we go. Shark comes in with six, but Doobie got the six in there first. Patrick goes seven. Now seven is the bid. Got Patrick at seven. Char with an asterisk, then an eight. Char is at eight. Char is at eight on the bid here. All right, Char, Oop, not nine, eight. Get that down, one down, one down, one. Bid down where it goes. There we go, that's better. All right, Char has got the deal right now. Char at eight. Oh, here we go, my friends, here we go. Looks like Char is net. Char is gonna grab it. Char is gonna grab it. Sold, sold, sold.
Hey, check out this loose one. A little Datsun. A little, uh, you know, you know, you know, check it out, folks. Check it out, ladies and gentlemen. Check it out. Check it out. Look at that little, uh, look at that little critter. Look at that little critter. Now, you know, of course, this was the one that was also the super, but this is just the mainline version of that particular little critter. Yeah, it's lagging really bad right now, folks. Lagging really, really bad, I'm telling you. All right. All right, all right, check this one out, folks. What do you say here? What do you say here? Who's interested in this one? Anybody on this one? $3 loose here, folks. I'll do it as a $3 loose, $3 loose, $3 loose. So Char is offering it to Derek if he wants it. So Derek, if you want those, let me know. Char is willing to uh, let you have them for your bid. The lag's bad on every platform tonight. Even Twitch, even Twitch is terrible. Felon just tested. Felon said it came through at four seconds for him, so that's pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good. Uh, less than a second for me. Of course, I'm right here in the studio. <laughs> right here in the studio, so that was easy, easy peasy. All right, so Patrick, are you grabbing this one? I see you got three tests. Are you grabbing this one, Patrick? Let me know. Gotcha, dude. Pretty much, pretty much, pretty much. All right guys, check this out. Now the card is not perfect. Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. All right, we'll take care of that, Char. All right, so check this out, folks. Card's not 100% perfect here. Now this one usually sells for about $25 if the card's in good shape. Card's just a little rough, so check it out. Here's your chance to pick up a pretty good little Ferrari there for 10 bucks. $10 to start that. All right, let me change that ticket. Get that changed here. All right. Done, done, and done.
where'd you go? Are you kidding me right now? You gotta be pulling my leg right now. I just... You dirty little turkey. Well, I'll grab something else. I'll grab something else here. We'll just make this a little more fun, exciting. All right. All righty then, folks. All right, all right, all right. Where did my real riders go? I had some cool real riders here. Let's this box. All right. Ooh, I've got some. I've got some pretty cool ones here. Like uh, now, this one's a little FTE here, folks. This one's a little on the FTE. Oops, on the faster than ever. <laughs> Check it out, folks. Ay ay ay. Man, now there's a good one for you. There's a good one for you. Yeah, Derek, you did. Here we go, my friends. FTE, check it out. $5 to start on the FTE. $5 to start on the FTE. Killer, cool, wicked little beast right there. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Alright guys, meanwhile, back here up front here, I have faster than ever wheels. We have a bully goat. Kind of a kind of a wicked little monkey there. Volkswagen New Beetle Cup on the faster than ever wheels. Whoa, this one's cool. And then, of course, I have. Oh, by the way, the Bullet Goat happens to be a first edition also. Redliner series. Faster than ever wheels. Pontiac Bonneville. All right, so here we go. One, two, and three. Oh, man, three, three FTEs. One money will take the lot. One money will take the lot of three right there. What do you say there, guys? This is pretty cool. Got, got some interesting combinations there. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure it was because uh, uh, I seen uh, I seen the colored version of it, and uh, so yeah, I I don't know if it was just a miss uh, paint or what the deal was on it, but yeah, it definitely looks like a Zamic. Bellin at five, Patrick at six. Here we go, six on the bid here. Patrick's got it at six. Patrick has the deal. I believe it is. I definitely believe that it is. Derek's got the deal here at six, folks. Sold, sold, sold. Nobody on that one, huh? All right. Aha. Check this one out. I like this one. 
I'm pretty sure you guys will know this one as soon as I flip it over. It is a Plymouth Grand Fury. One Adam 12, one Adam 12, respond to a 311 at the popsicle stand. Here we go, folks. Check it out. Check it out. Nice little Adam 12 squad car. I was just watching that uh, night before last over on Me TV. Check this out. Check this out, folks. Man, oh man, what do you say here? What do you say here? How about a bid? How about a bid? Let's get it going. Let's get it going. That's a nice little piece right there. Yep, Gavin and Malloy. That's right. I was what you know, and it's kind of hard, kind of hard to watch that sometimes when uh, when you look at the way that was done compared to um, police shows, the way they do them today. You know, <laughs> although it was the episode where they respond to a burglar, um, somebody trying to break into a house, and it turns out to be a raccoon. Kind of funny. Kind of funny, kind of funny. What do you say here, guys? What do you say? How about a bid? How about a bid? I got a three. I got a three. Not where I want to start, but it is a bid, so let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's clock that sucker. Let's clock it. Clock it, clock it, clock it. Check it out, check it out, check it out. I got three, now I got four. Now we got four on the bid, now we got a four. Now we got a five, now we got a five. Five was what I was looking for to start it, but hey, we got five, so we're there. It doesn't matter how you get there, as long as you get there. So they say. Five on the bid, five on the bid, five on the bid. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Five on the bid, doobie go six. Doobie go six. Here we go, here we go, six on the bid, six on the bid, six on the bid. Well, I think Adam 12 was a, a, a few years before uh, Chips, so, uh, but then again, Boss, you're a young pup though, man. You're a young pup compared to me, and um, so, uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I, remember, I remember watching it, you know, with my folks when it originally aired. If that tells you anything. We got six on the bid right now. Doobie's got the deal. Doobie's got the deal at six. And that is sold, sold, sold. Doobie with the deal. Six bones in the basket. All right, folks, real righty here. Johnny Lightning, Grand National. Give me a five to start it. Five to start on the Grand National. What do you say? Who'd bid five? Who'd bid five? Who'd a bid five? Man, I'm really surprised that nobody has jumped on this 2006 set because it's got that uh, Hot Wheels... Uh, Dodge Charger, the 06 with the Confederate flag, you know, kind of like the General Lee. That set is still sitting here. Well, actually, all four sets are still sitting here. Yeah, the original, yeah there you go. Original Wild West. Uh, let's see. Speaking of older TV shows, who remembers the Time Machine? Who 
Nobody on the Grandy National? All right, let me put some. Uh, Mike's going to grab throw a five at it. Here we go. Five on the bid. Five on the bid. Five is the bid. Mike's jumping on it. He heard, oh, Grand National. Oh, crap. Metal put up a Grand National. Rut row. Says, I got to get that one. Patrick goes six. I got Patrick at a six now on the bid. Yes, Johnny Lightning. At least I'm pretty sure it's a Johnny. Yep, Johnny Lightning. Mike goes eight. We got eight on the bid now. E is the bid. Patrick goes nine, now nine. Now nine, now nine, now nine. Patrick at nine. Mike goes 12. Cool little beast right there. Mike Young's got it for 12 bucks right there, right now. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. Yeah. I'm going to tell you, he's, he's, I'll tell you, that lag is absolutely killing him tonight over there on Facebook. We got to get that man over on Twitch. You don't have to, you don't have to, you don't have to be a tier subscriber to use Twitch to uh, bid here on this platform. All you got to do is just sign up for Twitch and follow Diecast TV Live. We are sold, sold, sold. Mike's got that one. All right, now here's a unique little uh, real rider. Uh, what is it? It's a 2009 Corvette Stingray Concept. Uh, is this a Boulevard car, I believe? I do believe that would be a Boulevard car. $5 to start. 5 bucks to start. Garage series. Well, I knew it was somewhere. I knew it had to be one of them. I just wasn't sure which one. Plus, well, so I figured somebody would know. I knew I could count on you guys, as always. Series, all right. What do you say there? What do you say? What do you say? Char went five. I got Patrick at six. I'm just now seeing messages coming through on the. Th oh my goodness gracious! Yeah, 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 yeah. What is up, dude? Freak in the house, man. Talk about long time no see. What is up, sir? How are you? Man, oh man, oh man. 
All right, so I got six on the bid here, folks. Six on this one. We are sold, sold, sold. Tell you what, guys, I've got a handful of a couple V dubs here. Tell you what, I'm gonna put them up all here on the loose side. <laughs> and boss welcoming welcoming freak back in his own unique way. Alright, guys, over here I'm gonna put four VWs up here. Four VWs. Two Matchbox, two Hot Wheels, two Matchbox Dare, and two Hot Wheels, including that little critter right there. Man, look at that beauty. That is a cool looking bug right there. All right, folks, check it out here. Check it out here, ladies and gentlemen. $5 starting bid for all four. Auction these off, $5 to start on all four. All four, all four. And it's that time again, ladies and gentlemen, where as you're looking at that, I got to do this. I got to do this, all right? Oops, not that. Not that, but that, not that. We have four factory sealed sets in the house 2010, 2009, 2008 never been taken out of its original shipping container and your 2006 factory sealed set now this 2006 set folks has that little critter right there I don't think it'll focus yeah, well the Dodge Charger 06 uh, kind of like the little General Lee thing there so check it out here folks now here's the deal on these of course as you know the 2010 set is a thousand. The other three sets are 750 each, or you can take all four, three thousand dollars. Open invoice is possible. Just saying. All right. So there, I did my little. Um, I brought it back up there, showing you guys. Ah uh, man, if I could just, you know, heck, I'd be happy if we just sold one of them. Yeah, no, but hey, you know, somebody wants all four. Whew. I know if I had 3,000, I'd throw it on it right here, right now. If I could spare the three anyway, that's, uh, I think that's all of our problems, you know, when we think about these things. All right, so let's go back over here. Copper's going to go six. Pork went five. Copper went six here. Six on the bid, six on the bid. Here we go. Clock is hot. Six is the bid. Six is the bid. I got copper in there with it on all those right there. Pretty good deal going on there. Pretty good little deal there. Yeah, very true. Open invoice, which will help. Definitely makes it easier. Definitely does, no question there. It's just that initial, you know, oomph, you know, to drop, to pull the trigger. Here we go, folks, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Sold, sold, sold. I got pork on that one. All right. Yeah, a VW smorgasbord. That's right. 
That's right, that's right, that's right. Lots of B-dubs. We just put the B-dubs up there and just let them go. B-dubs to the left of me, B-dubs to the right of me. B-dubs everywhere. All right, let me get that. Yeah, if I said pork, I'm sorry, it was copper. Char, though. I, I think you got the better end of the bargain there. I thought you got the better, I thought you got a good deal. I think you got a good deal there, right? All right. Whew. Boom, kabang, kapow, and boing. All right, where am I at now? Oh, yeah. Let me give you a $3 loose. Just a nice little $3 loose right there. Nice little $3 loose. Little loose, little loose, little loose, loose, loose. Out before I put them up here on a winner's choice. Alrighty, folks, so here we go. Let's go back up front here. I'll do a winner's choice here. We'll do a winner's choice. All right. Wayne's Garage. I have a tail dragger. Not saw No, uh, just a main. No chase. 57 Chrysler 300. No signature and no signature. All right, so here's your 57 Chrysler 300. And then I have a 32 Ford sedan. All, I've got two Larrys and one Wayne's Garage. Check it out. Check it out here, my friends. Check them out, check them out, check them out. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Little beauty right here, winner's choice. Garage cars here, folks. Would like to see a 10 to start. Would like to see a 10 to start on winner's choice. Winner's choice there. What do you say? What do you say? What do you say? Nice garage cars there. Who hadn't seen these in a while. Just happened to stumble across them in my digging this afternoon. All right, so over here, folks, on the loose side, ladies and gentlemen, we have a nice black wall uh, dump truck here. Check it out, folks. Now this thing, I will tell you. Now Robert Delaney brought me uh, brought me a few loose pieces this evening before before he left. Uh, 
and uh, before they left to go out to dinner and uh, this was one of those pieces all right now I do need a 10 to start that one that will be a $10 start on that crazy little critter there but that's not all because he brought me some other pretty cool ones here Ten on the bid, and here we go. Clock is hot, clock is hot. Ten is the bid, ten is the bid here. Ten is the bid, ladies and gentlemen. Let me get that up there. Derek's got it at ten. All right, ten is the bid here, there, and every, uh-oh, uh-oh. And after this one, I think we're gonna jump in the car, take a ride downtown to Dub City. Here we come. A little 63 Lincoln old school Jada. 11. I got Doobie at 11. Doobie at 11. Doobie at 11 here. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Doobie at 11. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go. Now, you know, of course, particular color and everything on this one came out over several years, several different releases on that one. And generally, the color never changed. You might see some different wheel hubs and stuff like that. Doobie's got the deal right here at 11. I've got one more for you, Char. One more, I think, here. We'll get to that here in just a sec. In about two seconds, I should say. It's sold, sold, sold. Doobie got that one. All right, folks, here we go. Holy cow, kaboom, kabang, kapow. Look at this Jada. Look at this Jada. Look at this Jada. Dub City 63 Lincoln. Beauty right there. Jada, Jada old school. Jada old school. Let's see. I've got I've got Doobie on this one. Mike Young had come in with a five. Mike Young come in with a five on the Jada there. Here we go. Here we go. Let's clock that critter. Clock it. Clock it. Clock it. We got five. Uh, Felon went five. Patrick went five. Now Shaw is six. Uh, now ten from Mike. Mike Young at ten. Mike Young at ten now. All the way up at ten on this little critter. Check it out. Check it out. Woo. Char goes twelve. Char takes it to twelve. Now twelve on the bid. Now twelve. Now twelve. Oh my gosh. This got sassy fasty here. Fifteen. Mike at fifteen. Mike at fifteen now. Mike at 15, Patrick's at 14, but Mike's got 15 in there. All right, here we go. Let's get her, get her, get her. 15 on the bid here. Mike's got it. Mike Young has it right now for 15. Man, the bids came in pretty quick on this one. Whoo. And I've got 10 on the winner's choice over here. 10 on the winner's choice. So we'll get to that here in just a second. Right now, 15 is the bid here. Mike Young's got it. We're down to 10 seconds on the clock. That is sold, sold, sold. Now I am noticing, generally, the, there's only about a five second delay from the, from, the, from the broadcast to when it pops up on the platforms, but right now that delay is about 17 seconds. So, whew, that's really weird right there tonight, that that is the case on that. 
All right, so I've got 10 on the winner's choice here. So let's jump back up front here. Here we go, 10 is the bid here. Let's clock it, here we go, here we go, here we go. 10 is the bid, 10 is the bid. Ten is the bid of Rooney, bid of Ronnie, bid of Ronnie on winner's choice. All right, we got ten right now. Right, let me look. Okay, nothing else coming in there just yet. Ten's the minimum start, guys. Ten's the minimum start. Ooh, Felon's gonna be sneaky. I see what he's up to. I see what the man's up to. All right, we are sold, sold, sold. Derek, what you after there? Guys, let me get another loose one up here while we're hanging on here for just a moment. All right. Meanwhile, let's jump over here. Check out this loose one. Now, Robert brought me two different ones of these. Two different ones of these here this evening. The orange with the yellow bed and the yellow with the orange bed. Now, on these two, um, I'll tell you here, folks, um, it's going to be, I need at least 10 to start on choice. 10 to start on choice there. The orange one is, yep, it does, it is missing a headlight. All right, Derek's gonna go to the 32 Ford. since it does have well actually I was told 15 a piece on these so um, but uh, tell you, I will pull the one I'll pull the one out of there the one with the missing head right there doggone it that's sad that's a good that's a good piece too it's a cool little casting cool little casting there all right fellas I'll take your five dollar elephant bid here I uh, probably I'll probably hear about it, but uh, but Felon did put a five dollar elephant bid in there, and I of course I should have said ten dollar was the minimum start, so that's on me, Felon. You got choice, buddy. Which one? Which one? Which one? No, sure, nothing to be sorry about. You noticed something I didn't, and I appreciate it when you guys catch it. No doubt in my mind. No doubt in my mind there. Oh, please, Felon. You, me, like I really care if I get sent to the principal's office. I mean, we've seen stuff go out of here. You know, I mean, you, you've, we've seen it forever. Uh, from people uh, letting stuff go a lot less than what I do. So, Are you sure, buddy? Are you sure? You sure? You sure? Because uh, I'll, I will 
Oh, I'll take it. I will accept it. All right, buddy. All right. I appreciate it, but uh, you know, you're more than welcome to because All right, all right, so Felon is passing then, folks. So $10 was the winning bid. So $10 for choice. If you want them, call them out. If you want them, call them out. On the two Larrys. Ten each right there just let me know which one on those all right and then of course folks I got this one right here I am looking for 10 on that looking for a minimum of 10 there I will tell you what from the shop truck series check it out folks $5 real rider here, $5 start. $5 to start. Somebody want to give me the five to start it? I got five from Char and clock is hot. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Shine here at five. Shine here at five. All right, uh, last chance on those two Larrys before I pull them. Anybody want some ten bucks of ten bucks each? Doobie go six. I got doobie going six. Doobie going six on the bid. Whoa, 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 whoa! Everything's gone screwy here. Six is the bid. Six is the bid. Ah, yeah, yeah. Everything's gone bonkier is there. All right, I'll pull the garage ones. Got Doobie at six. Doobie at six right now. Hector at seven. Hector at seven, Hector at seven. Hector at seven. Derek seen an orange dump truck in the background. All right, let me take a look. Obviously, I'm missing something somewhere there. I got Hector at seven right now. Hector at seven on the bid here. Mr. Vargas, what's up, dude? What's up, what's up, what's up? Sold, sold, sold. Hector grabs it. All right, guys, I'll do another winner's choice up front here real quick, and then I'm going to find that. Find that orange dump truck. Sets. Uh, I must be blind tonight. All right, uh, let's see. Nope, not signed. Here is the shift kicker. Larry's Garage shift kicker. We have a Phil's Garage 41 Pro Mod Willies. Cool. I love the coloring on this one. This one's really neat. And then, ladies and gentlemen, we have 
the Rolling Thunder, Wayne's Garage Rolling Thunder. So I have Larry's fills and Wayne's Garage pieces right here. Here's your Rolling Thunder. So check them out, folks. $10 start. $10 start here. Winner's choice. Winner's choice here. Whoops. Winner's choice. Winner's choice. Winner's choice. Check them out there. Check them out there. All right. Orange dump truck. Where in the flying fudge? Go, folks here we go here we go anybody in on those no nope. all right I need another loose one then oh check this one out folks all right now I will tell you uh, this next loose one here all right check this out it is the Peterbilt cement mixer now we have one of these carded in the backyard and it's worth it's worth sixty dollars plus here it is loose all right so check it out folks check it out there give me a 10 to start that wicked little black wall 10 to start that wicked little black wall there all right here we go here we go what do you say what do you say all right, orange dump truck. I'm not seeing it. What? Where am I? What am I missing? Where am I missing it here? You think that would stick out like a sore thumb? Doobie throws a ten. I got ten from Doobie. Ten on the bid here. Ten on the bid. Do be in here at 10. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Do be at 10 right now. Do be at 10, do be at 10, do be at 10. Guys, help me out here. Where is that orange dump truck at? Where was it? It was when I showed the sets. It was hanging on. Uh, it said hanging on the sh on the shelf on the peg. Camera angles facing this way. What on earth? I got Doobie at ten. He's going to pick that one up. How about the blue one? How about that blue one? I got a blue one. Got a blue one, blue one, blue one there. Check it out, check it out. So that would be my left, which is your right. Or as I'm facing, would be to the right side of the sets. I have a wacky winner's garbage truck. Uh, let's see. If it's over there on that side, all right. What do you say here, folks? What do you say here? Looking for 10, looking for 10 on this one as well. Looking for a 10 on this one as well. So let's see here, guys. Let's see, let's see, and let's see. So when I showed these sets, I 
So when I showed these sets, Derek noticed a orange dump truck. So there we go. Alright. I thought I thought if I looked through the camera it would help, but I just don't. Ah oh, crap. Alright, anyway. Anyway, anyway, anyway. So nobody on the winner's choice and nobody oops. Nobody on this one. Alright, let me grab a different one here and I'll keep looking because I know it's there. It's gotta be there somewhere. All right, folks, $3 loose, $3 loose, $3 loose. $3 loose. All right. That, that's that that's okay yeah that one that was the loose one that was the loose one it was red it wasn't orange it was red it was the one that we had up earlier that was the one we had up earlier that red dump truck I know it looked orange but it was actually red but yep that's it it's the only one I had that's the only one I had there sitting loose on that side Thank you, boss. Appreciate that there. Doobie grabbed it for an 11. All right. Derek's going to grab the loose one. Here's a wicked little real rider, 68 Cougar. Check that crazy critter out. Check that crazy critter out right there. Give me a five to start. Five to start it. Let's go, let's go. Oh man, here's a killer cool real rider coming up as well. Check it out, check it out. I think it was just the way it was sitting because the picture that Boss sent, I can understand how that would look that way. But yeah, I don't, that was the only one I had over there on that side, on the cart that I brought in with me. And I'm looking on the cart behind it. It's the only one I see there, unfortunately. That was the only one. And it does, it does, it looks on to the picture, I get that. All right, so looking for a bid there to start that one. I thought we had one in the package around here somewhere. We had one in here a few days back. All right. I got Hector at five. All right, here we go. Five is the bid here. Five is the bid, five is the bid, five is the bid.
It's right here. All right, sold, sold, sold. You know, the thing is, I know we've got it carded. I know we got it carded. <laughs> uh oh. Uh, I'll tell you what, that is a pretty good photo. That is a pretty good photo there, Adam, but uh, I, I'm not going to comment, though. Not gonna comment there, but yeah, pretty good photo of that Stang Banger for sure. I'll have to show it. Great little Mustang. I don't know why I say little, because they're not really little. They're pretty cool. Check this out, folks. Mickey Thompson. Ooh. Now, guys, I do need... This one here is going to be... Uh, I'll run it at five, but uh, oh man, really, really should be more like ten. But uh, I'm more of in a five dollar mood. On, I'm just feeling five on this one. Just feeling five on this one. So check it out. Check it out. Got Doobie throwing a five. Doobie throwing a five here. Let me double check. Make sure we're good here. Yep. Uh, let's see. No, I'm sorry. Sure. I've got. Okay, hang on here. Everything's all messed up here. I've got Char at five. Correct. Char at five. Hector at five. Doobie at five. So here we go, 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 here we go. Guys, this is from the Slick Ride series. So definitely real riders. Hector at seven. Hector at a seven. Doobie at a seven, but Hector got the seven in there first. at eight. Patrick in there with an eight. Here we go. Got Doobie at nine. Doobie at nine. Doobie at a niner. Niner, niner, niner. Well, we're about where I wanted to be to start, so I'm uh, breathing easier. <laughs> we got Doobie at nine. We got uh, Patrick at ten. Patrick's in there at 10. Hector comes in with a 10, but Patrick was in just a split second before there. All right, so right now 10 is the bid. Hector at 12. Now 12 on the bid, now 12, now 12, now 12. Now 12. Now 12 on the bid, here we go now. 13, 13, 13, 13. Do be throwing a 13, do be throwing a 13. Here we go, here we go. Hector at 15. Hector at 15 on the bid here, 15 on the bid, 15 on the bid. 15. All right, there we go. All right, all right. Doobie, 16. Doobie at 16, Doobie at 16 now. Doobie at 16. Derek comes in with 13, but we're already at 16 there. That lag, I tell you that, I feel bad, man. I feel bad because that lag just flat out sucks. All 
We got Hector at 17. Seventeen on the bid now. Doobie at nineteen. Not quite, not quite, not quite. Doobie throwing a nineteen at it. Right, Doobie won't be denied. 20 seconds left, and only time will tell here as it ticks down. Tick tock, tick tock. Tick tock. Derek comes in with a 20. Aye, aye, aye. 20 on the bid now. Twenty on the bid. Twenty on the bid. Derek flies in there. He's finally like, okay. In order for me to make this work, I got to go higher than what I think they're gonna be. Twenty is the bid here. Twenty is the bid. Twenty is the bid. Yep, from the Slick Ride series. Here we go, 20 on the bid here, 20 on the bid, folks. Ten seconds left, Derek's got the deal. Twenty-three came in, twenty-three came in right before the clock kicked right there. Doobie comes in with twenty-three. Man, oh man, oh man. I'm going to rewatch that, but I saw it come in before it clicked over. So we've got 23 on the bid right now. Yep, he came in with one second on the clock there. Doobie with the buzzer beater. That's right. Doobie from beyond the half court range fires at the buzzer. Boom! So Doobie's got it right now for 23. Doobie's got it right now for 23. Check it out, check it out. Doobie at 23. Holy crap, I just lost my feed. Uh-oh. All right, let me get that back up there. Come on now. Okay, 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 okay. That got scary. 23 on the bid here, 23 on the bid, and the dupester grabs it. Man, oh man, oh man. Killer grab. Killer grab, and here I was worried that we weren't even gonna get to 10 on that. Phew. Man, oh man, oh man. Woohoo. Nice grab. All right, now this one's not going to be quite as exciting. This one's not going to be quite as exciting, but it is a real rider. A little wins, a little purple band. I know, not as exciting and fun as the other, but there you go. So you got that one to look at and to think about there, folks. And $5 to start that one on the real rider. But I'm, whoops, 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 whoops. Let's go back up front here. I'm going to give you another, another three for here. 83 Chevy Silverado. 67 Chevy C10. And a faster than ever, off track.
So, 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 I was trying to find a third truck, and this is the only one I could find truck-wise. The card's not the greatest, folks, as you know, but that's why you're getting these up here for three for one money takes off. And I've got Hector at five. Hector at five over here on the loose. Here we go, here we go. I got Hector at five. Doobie come in with five. Uh, right off the top of my head, I don't have any in here with me. It doesn't mean that we don't. It just means that in the ones I brought in, I only had the one. Got Doobie at six. Doobie at six here. Doobie at six, Hector at 10 on the three pack. Okay, I got Hector at 10 up, up front. Right now we're six here. And we are at six here, check it out. Hector at seven here. I wish I had some more of those. Man, oh man, that was a good little, good little battle right there. I wish I had a few more of those. We got seven on the bid here. Patrick comes in at seven, but Hector came in at seven first. Patrick at eight. Come on, get moving, you. Man, oh man, oh man, I think the whole system's just gonna crash here on one of these, one of these days here. Eight is the bid here. Patrick's got the deal. Doobie comes in with nine. Doobie follows that up with a niner. Man, oh man, oh man. We got some, we got some fighting going on here tonight. Uh, let's see, Patrick with 10. Patrick now with a 10. Hector with 10, Patrick at 10 first. We've got Doobie with an 11. Got Doobie at 11. Here we go. Alrighty now. Doobie's got the dealio. Twenty seconds left, and then, then we'll nope. <coughs> then we'll jump up front, as I've got ten on the three pack up front. And sold, sold, sold. Doobie got that one. All right, so let's jump up front here, folks. I got 10 on the bid here. 10 on the bid here. Here we go. Kaboom, kabang, kapow, boing. There we go. 10 is the bid. I got Hector at 10 on this. Got two pretty cool trucks. I didn't even got the faster than ever. Probably, what, about $25 worth of trucks right there, give or take. I just wish the cards were perfect. 
But, you know, you get a chance to get some decent vehicles at a good price this way. Uh, something to be said for damaged cards. What that is, I don't know. Excuse me, goodness. Ten here, sold, 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 sold. All right. All righty, folks. So, up next. I'm going to give you another little winner's choice here. Now, this one should be a little more interesting because it's, uh, well, you'll see. You'll see here in just a second. I have Boulevard cars. I have the Fantastic. We have the 78 Ford Mustang 2. Wicked little beast right there. And I have the Double Demon. Boulevard cars, all real riders. Holy crap here, folks. Holy crap here. Check them out, check them out, folks. Check them out. Winner's choice here, starting at 10. Winner's choice there starting at 10. And then over here on the loose side, faster than ever wheels, the Pikes Peak Tacoma. Uh, $5 start, Pikes Peak Tacoma. Nice, check it out. Check it out. All right, so here we go here. I got 10 on choice. Uh, Patrick is in with the 10. Here we go, let's clock it. 10 is the bid. 10 is the bid, 10 is the bid, 10 is the bid. 10 is the bid. Uh-oh, Doobie's not aware of our uh, new policy that uh, if you admit that you're going to scalverge or whatever, we cancel the bid and we give it to the next person. <laughs> Check it out. Yeah, that's it's got good wheels, good wheels there. Definitely has good wheels on it, without a doubt. I got Alex in here at 12. Alex at 12 on choice. Alex at 12 on choice here now. Here we go, here we go. All right. Aye, aye, aye. Now things have got, gotten a little more interesting as we work through the evening here. Alex at 12 on choice. <laughs> and I'll let you guys argue that one out. I'll let you guys, yeah, you guys can fight that one out. I'll just hang out here. I'll go get some popcorn and I'll sit back. And Alex has got the deal here. Alex, what you after, buddy? Alex wants the Mustang only. All right, so Alex takes the Mustang. All right, Hector, you had, or no, Patrick, you had 10. Uh, either one of the other two. Either one of the other two there, Patrick. You were the other bidder. We got the choice of the two. Alex just wanted the stain banger. So Alex has got that. Patrick is going to take the double demon. All right, got you there. Anybody else? Anybody want the fantastic?
That seems to be the one that nobody ever takes. That one winds up back on the shelf, and every time we get Boulevard cars, it still winds up going back on the shelf. That poor thing, I don't think I could even give it away. All right. All right, guys. Ooh, here's a wicked little real rider. Let's jump back over here. Let's jump back over here. Check out the, ooh, look at the real rider. Look at that real rider. Pretty doggone sweet. No, you didn't miss a Mustang, Char. You didn't miss a Mustang. Uh, I won't tell you that it was a Boulevard Mustang, yellow with blue interior. Patrick's going five here. Five on the bid, five on the bid. Five on the bid here. Check it out. Well, had I known that, sure, I would have told, I would have, ah, uh, man, oh man, oh man. So that's why he sent me the photo. That's why he sent me the photo. Patrick grabbed this one. No, he, he sent me a nice photo of the Mustang. Real killer. That's a nice, I'll tell you, they, they got a nice Mustang over the weekend. I can't believe that nobody else but Patrick went after that one. All right, guys. Oh, goodness gracious. Here's a nice little black wall. Nice little black wall there. Check it out. And ladies and gentlemen, up front, I have a 143rd scale piece up front here for you. Take a good look at this one. Here it is, folks. 143rd scale racing champions. None other than the number 43, STP, Richard Petty. Check it out. Good piece one. Box. Okay. As with racing champions, these boxes never really held up well to begin with. All right, but check it out, folks. Nice little 143rd scale here. Great little STP, heavy blue, red stripe, great car. Right there. Good one, good one, good one here, folks, man. Check it out, check it out, check it out, check it out. <laughs> Adam says, Budweiser was calling my name, brother. Well, there you go, man. You gotta do what you gotta do what you gotta do. That's right. That's right, that's right. That's right. I could go for a Guinness right now myself, honestly. But everything shuts down. Every, this county goes dry at midnight. So which would be about the time I get out of here. So poopy. But anyway, here we go, folks. Nice little 143rd scale here. All right, so check that one out. Box is a little rough, guys, but I will, uh, whew, I'll start it at 10. We'll fire it up there to 10 and see if anybody wants it. It is a 143rd scale, so no, the 10's a pretty good place to be there. Alrighty, we'll jump over here. I'll pull the Baja breaker down. 
And folks, I have a couple bubble gummers. A couple bubble gummers. The yellow one, oh wait a minute, I'll have to do these separately because the yellow one is real riders. This one has real riders on it there. Check it out, check it out. That does have real rider tires. Uh, hang on, Char. Uh, is it, um, are you talking this one? Are you talking this one or the other one? This is the House of Cards one, so I'm pretty sure this is the one you're referring to. The 83 Chevy Sylvie. Gotcha. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. I think I've got one more back there, guys, if anybody's interested. I've got one more of those there. You're welcome, Char. Thank you. I appreciate that. All right, guys, come on. i got to at least get 10 there. Uh, five to start here. I know the bubble gummers aren't very popular. I get that. Never, never been. I don't think I've ever actually sold one, be it loose or carded in any configuration whatsoever. Right. All right, guys, check this out. Dodge D50 High Raker Series. All right, now I have this one carded. I have this one carded as well, folks. Carded, I need 50. I need 50 for it carded. Where'd it go? Unless somebody sold it. I thought it was still up here. Maybe not. No, I don't see it. Did somebody buy it? But anyway, Doobie's going to go five in the real rider because he wants those wheels for a Camaro. All right, all right. I'll tell you what. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Five is the bid. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. That poor bubble gummer. Got to become a fishing sinker. Ah, there it is. Yes, I do have it carded. Man, I wish I had the Ferrari crowd in here tonight, because, man, I had some good ones. I had some pretty neat little Ferraris in here tonight. Doobie's going to grab this one for a fiver. Oh, I'm sure it's going on a Camaro. I mean, you know, Doobie, you know, you know. He'll take those off and then he can put a little, he can drill a hole, put a little swivel-like attachment to it there and use it that for, use the rest of it for a fishing sinker. <laughs> sold, sold, sold. Doobie got it. All right, so guys up front, here is the carded Dodge D50 in the High Raker series. The engine is going in a red baron, says Doobie. Ooh, 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 dang. Will that fit in a red baron? I don't know. Anyway, here's the carded High Raker Dodge D50. Looking at uh, half a Picasaurus for that. Would be looking at a 50 there. 
Now I do have it loose over here. There you go, check that out. Check that one out. Check that one out. Well, it can't be bothering them too bad because um, uh, if they didn't want him to, uh, to take those wheels and put them on a Camaro, they would have bid against him. So I don't think it bugs them too much. <laughs> right? All right. All right, folks. Now, the, this, the high rake is on here. <laughs> the, high, the high raking mechanism on these work all the way. All right. There it is up. And there it is back down. Now, I do have two of these. One's in a little bit better shape than the other. All right. I do have two of them here, as you can see. One up, one down. <laughs> oh my. All right, guys, I'll tell you what here on these. These, they're a little rough. Yes, I get that. I uh, need some TLC here. Uh, I will go the pair for 20 or $10. We'll do a $10 winner's choice, all right? $10 winner's choice. On either one of those right there, my friends. Right. All righty, guys, I'll tell you what. Let's see, it's about that time, so let's go on through another, let's do another quick run through of what few pieces I do have. Them is Mopars, yes they are, the Dodge D50s. Dodge D50s. All right, all right, Metal, let's run through what's in the backyard here again really quick. Char says, show my picture one more time. All right, let me go over here to Messenger. All right, here we go. Now this one, this one was sent to me by Adam. Sent me this one of the, man, look at that, look at that. Pretty sweet. Now let me get the Char, now let me get the ones that Shar sent over here real quick. Oh, there she is. And uh, scroll down, scroll down, scroll back. Here we go. Now here is the ones that Shar sent as well. Let's see. I'll hold it there. Then we'll scroll through. Hey, you know that's illegal parking, right? <laughs> Hey, look, there's cup holders. Everybody's always asking, does it have cup holders? Yes, it does. Ooh, cool beans, right? And there we go. Man, oh, oh you see my Grammy fingerprints on the screen there. There you go, man. There you go, there you go. Killer, cool. Oh, wait, 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 there's one more. There is one more. And it's another shot of the interior, man. Check it out. Cool stuff. Cool stuff. Whew. Nice car. All right. So let's, like I said, guys and gals, let's run through the backyard one more time here. Got a few Supers still sitting in the backyard. And I've still got those four sets over here. Just saying. with that evil little laugh. That evil little laugh kind of uh, under my breath. All right, so here we go. Here we go. All right. So 
Let me pull that Dodge V50 back here. All right, so here's, oh. Holy cow, guys, I didn't see this one in the back earlier. Check out the Caterpillar dump truck. That's that big boy. That's that big mining, mining one right there. That is in the Workhorse series. Man, oh man, check it out. Wicked little beast right there. Got that one hanging out in the backyard here. We still have the Wild Blue Gasser. Uh, this is a Robert Delaney piece, I do believe, and that is a $50 start on that one from Robert's collection. I have a 1980s Corvette from the Hot Ones. Right, from the Hot Wheels Hall of Fame. Speaking of Ferraris. Man, oh man, oh man. Check it out. Shoo, this is a good one. This is a good one. It's the Ferrari 330 P4 Daytona winner from 1967. Check it out there. Now this one, folks, uh, it's a half a Picasaurus. This one is a $50 start. All right, ooh, what do I, oh my, look at this uh, little Cadillac V16 T hunt. Nice little treasure hunt right there. Wicked, wicked, wicked little beast. Sitting right back there. Of course, the House of Cars. Here's that great little square body. 83 Chevy Silverado. I'm gonna check that one out. Then, of course, we have the Mongoose Factory Team. Nice Mongoose Factory Team there. Check that one out. 20 dollar bike now on that one this little critter right here a uh, little caddy v6 uh that one there ten dollar start on the t hunter oh look at this super the mega thrust Super T hunt. And as you can see, unfortunately, there's a lot, a little flaking, a lot of flaking here. Now I do, I do have the main line of this one. I think we had the T hunt on this one. I do believe it's out in the other room. Do believe it's out there in the other room. I could pair those up if anybody would be interested. I got ten on the caddy. And on the caddy right here, folks, check it out. All right, here we go. Let me come back around here and make sure we got Hector at 10. All right, here we go, here we go. 10 is the bid right here, folks. It's just, that lighting just bugs me, but here we go. Clock is hot, my friends. $10 is the bid here. 10 is the bid. in on this one. And that should be up at 10. I don't know why it's sitting at 6 because it is. Yeah, it was well, the limited number one. Yeah, definitely. Without a doubt on that one. And we are sold, sold, sold here.
All right. And I'm going to go back up front. I'm going to take these down here real quick because, folks, I have a white Ferrari. Oh, man. Check this critter out. Guys and gals, holy cow here. Holy cow. Check it out, folks. Man, oh, man, oh, man. Uh, I need a little bit of a bid to get that one going. We got that one sold there. All right, so let me come back around here. All right, meanwhile, from the Speed Fleet series, we have a Shadow Jet, Black Wall. Black Wall Shadow Jet right there. Check it out. Ten bucks on this one. Ten bucks will get that one going. On the Shadow Jet there from the Speed Fleet series. All right. Then, of course, I do have the Chase of the Willys Coop Gasser. And I have the main line, 65 for the pair. It's basically buy one, get one free because the Chase itself is 60. So, you know, if you want the Chase and the main, it's better to take the $65 deal. And that's a buy it now offer, by the way. That will be a buy it now offer. Won't even, won't even run the clock if somebody wants it. The same deal here on the Chevy sedan delivery gasser. This is the Chase. I have the main line as well. And that's a $65 buy it now. We've got the nice little 73 Chevy Cheyenne Super 10 from the Weekend of Wheels. Check that one out. Nice, 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 nice. Only 3,600 of these were made. Uh, 40 bucks will get you this one. All right, back here. Ooh, look at this one. I have a nice little 55 Chevy panel. 55 Chevy panel. Uh, it's marked at about 50, but I will start it at 40 if anybody wants to get this cool little Neo Classic Series panel. Uh, I will let this one go for 40. Then, of course, like I said, I've got some supers back here. Nice little 84 Avis Sports Quattro Super T Hunter. Check that one out, folks. Man, that is cool, cool, cool. Right there. Now, this thing has sold for well over 100 bucks in the past. It's just crazy, right? 45. 45 will get you this one. 45 will get that one fired off. We have the, ooh, the, the Peng Guy little roadster. Super D Duper Treasure Hunt. There, check it out. Another nice little super. Uh, that's got a $45 tag on it as well. These must be Roberts. I do believe those two supers are. All right. As well as this super right here, which is the 65 Ford Galaxy. Nice little super there as well. 45 bucks. And uh, man, I should have really pushed the, this, these next couple a little bit more. Here, factory sealed, 2006. Check it out. The mystery vehicle, the VW Drag Bus. VW Drag Bus, now check it out. This one's really cool, folks. Uh, we'll take a Picosaurus to get this one going. We do need 100 on that one. Here is the dairy delivery from that 2006 factory sealed set. As well, I should say it's got the 2006 factory sealed set logo on it. The mystery car as well. And there it is in the dairy delivery. Sweet, sweet, sweet little dairy here, folks. 50 bucks on that one. All right, folks, here we have the blown Camaro Z28. 
this one was released in 1991. Now, this one is on the Malaysian base, which is harder to find. The Malaysian base is actually a rarer one in this case. Check it out there, folks. Now, it is tagged at 60 plus. It says, you know, it says 60 right there. If somebody wants to throw 50, I will take that and run with it. Really cool Z28 blown Camaro there. All right. So there we go. And then, of course, we have the Diecast Supercon 41 Willys Coupe Gasser sitting right there as well. So there you go. All right, there are those right there. If you've seen one there that you would like, let me know. We can definitely go over it again. All right. All right, guys, let's see. Was there any interest in the Ferrari at all? Hmm. Not the night for Ferraris, is it? Definitely not the night for Ferraris. Let's see here. All right, I'll tell you what. What haven't I put up here yet? Let's get a couple more. Let's try a couple more loose ones here. So we're missing several people several people that usually go uh, you know get in there after for eyes uh, not only bad Timmy but um, Juan um, let's see and a, a couple other guys that usually really go after him. real rider here folks yeah I have a, yeah I think Timmy is kind of AOL there isn't he A W O L, I should say. A wall, yep. A W O L there. All right, so let me get that one. Uh, where'd it go? Not right there. All right. Here we go. Here we go. There it is, right there. The '73 Chevy Cheyenne Super Ten. Check it out, man. Check it out. Check it out. Uh, let's see, only 3,600 pieces of this one from the wild weekend of wheels. And there you go, man. There you go, there you go, there you go. Alright. And there it is. Really cool piece on the card there. And then, of course, the very last, one of the last things I am going to do here. And like I said, guys, $40 will get you that one. And of course, let's not forget these factory sealed sets. Now, I will tell you this much, folks. I know Hocus Pocus Vapor Rooney is really interested in these. Uh, almost to the point that I think I would not be surprised if he doesn't throw the 3,000 at all four of them tomorrow. Alright. So there they are. 2010 set. It's got a thousand dollar price tag on it. The other three sets, the six, the eight, and the nine. You can get those factory sealed sets for 750 bucks. Um, I know, I know, I know it's a big, it's a big chunk, a big jump to try to get one of these folks, and I understand that. But as I always say, I'm more than willing to open the invoices. More than willing to open invoices uh, to help you guys out because I mean, let's face it, I want you guys, I want you guys to get these. Plain and simple. So, if you're thinking about one, uh, don't don't let it don't go don't think about it too long because I just got a weird feeling that tomorrow uh, tomorrow afternoon 
probably within the first 30 minutes or so, I imagine all four of these will be gone. 3,000 3, will take all four, gut. Uh, 3,000 will take all four. These are valued at over 4,000. They dropped the price on three of them to 750. Uh, the 2006, 2008, and 2009. 2010 set still sitting at 1,000. But yeah, uh, 3,000 takes all three. three uh, all four. 3,000 takes all four of those sets. And the 2008 set, as you can see right here, is still in the factory seal, the shipping container box, still sealed. It has never been opened, never been removed. 2006, of course, has that nice little uh, General Lee knockoff right there in that one. All right. And like I said, guys, we will, we will open invoices on those. And he says, let me talk to my financial advisor. She just smacked me in the head. Well, all I can say is um, just let her know that these rarely, if ever, show up for sale. You know, they rarely, if ever, show up for sale. And when they do, they usually go for big money. Uh, the 2010 set. Um, new models, garages, all that other stuff. Good FTEs, hot auction series, 24 mystery cars. Um... Uh, and th this one is number 50 of 500. That 2010 set is number 50 of 500. And let's see, it says this 2010 factory sealed set includes 447 Hot Wheels vehicles, including all collector number mainline vehicles released in 2010. All 107 new models, including 44 new models and 63 recolors, which is, um, and then, of course, all uh, 2,000, all 202 of the uh, 10 series of 10 vehicles, uh, 100 new models and 102 real colors, all the good wrench, all the Goodyear vehicles, all 54 race worlds, including six recolors, the track stars, the mystery cars, and the promotional cars. It says there, um, let's see, new models, new models. T Hunt series listed there. There's the track stars. There's all the other ones. Just crazy cool sets all the way around. All the way around there on those. <laughs> uh, pretty much. Yeah. For, yeah. When you think of, when you think about it that way, yeah. You know, 400, 400 plus cars for less than three bucks a car. So there you go. All right. All right. So just to recap that, 3,000 takes all four or 1,000 for the 2010 set. The other three sets, 750 each. And open invoice is possible there. All right. And here we are. We're sitting on that one right there. I've got Derek over here on the loose one, so let's get this loose one run right out real quick here. All right, folks, and this will pretty much wrap it up here for tonight. After this loose one right here, folks. <laughs> well, I can tell you what Crafty would do to me if I even thought about, even thought about purchasing them. I'll tell you, it's hard to look at them and not want to take one home, you know, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I got you guys. All right, so here we go here. Doobie goes six. Doobie's not done fighting yet tonight. Doobie's going to throw a six. <laughs> so it looks like we got a little bit of a fight going on here yet tonight. Doobie at six, Doobie at six. Oops. Oh, wait, a couple other pieces 
I didn't show yet tonight. Let me fire these up here real quick before we go too. All right, so hey Char, thanks for stopping in tonight. Appreciate it as always. Without a doubt. Always like having our friends in here, friends and family. All right, looks like Doobie's gonna take this one. Sold, sold, sold. All right, guys, just a couple other things real quick that I didn't get to tonight. Let me run these through real fast. Bronco four-wheeler, card number 56. This one was put out in 1991. Check that out right there, $10 to start that one. I have the 1987. 1987 release of the Action Command, the Stingrod. I don't know if this is the first appearance of the Stingrod or not, but I gotta tell you, it's uh, from the Action Command series. Pretty cool piece right there. Um, and I'll tell you what, folks, uh, $15, that'll be buy it now on that one. $10, buy it now on the Bronco. Folks, we have from 1992, of course, we have the 80s Firebird, 80s Fire Chicken there. Check that out, folks. Cool piece there as well. That one also is a $10 buy it now on those. So there you go. I don't know if you're interested in any one of those three. I have three other carded high rakers here too, by the way. And... Uh, I will tell you that here we go. We have the Vet Van in, red, in black. I have the Vet Van in red. All right, right there. Uh, these are $35 each. And then I have the three window 34 on the unpunched card. Three window 34 unpunched card high raker series. This one here is a $45 on that one. So there we go, folks. Those are the ones I didn't get to tonight, but I did want to show them really, really quick here before we call it a day. So, all right, my friends. All right, if there's anything else you'd like to see real quick, let me know here. Otherwise, we are going to call it a night. All right, uh, Derek, what do you what do you putting the tin on there, buddy? What did you put the tin on? The Bronco, you got it, dude. Yours. Good deal on that one. Good deal, good deal, good deal, good deal. All right, gotcha. All right. Oh, I hope I just didn't break that camera. That'll be coming out of my paycheck for years. <laughs> All right, my friends, that is going to do it then, ladies and gentlemen. That'll wrap it up here for us for today. All right, guys, hey, thanks a lot, man. Really appreciate y'all hanging out here with me today, man. Good stuff here. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. Uh, tomorrow will be, uh, let's see, kickstand will be in here tomorrow as well. So I will be back again prime time from 8 to midnight tomorrow night. Uh, so Rick will be on tomorrow afternoon with Robert Delaney. They'll be on from 1 to 4.30, 5-ish. Uh, when Kickstand takes over, he'll take you to 7.15, 7.30. And then I'll be back in from 8 to midnight tomorrow night. Uh, but then that's the last day Kyle will be with us this week. Uh, so then more than likely the rest, uh, so let's see, that'll be what, Wednesday? 
So Thursday and Friday, it'll probably be 7 to 11 for prime time. Uh, we'll see. So all right, folks. Once again, thank you all so much. We really appreciate you, one and all. All right, folks. So may, I'll, I'll be taking you over to the stream store, of course, here. But uh, everybody have a great night, my friends. As you know, we love each and every one of you here because without you guys, we couldn't do this. And it's you guys and gals that make this what it is for us. So, uh, you know, first of all, I really appreciate you guys letting me come into your homes every night, and uh, which is awesome. And, uh, you know, I get to do a job that I tell you that I don't really think of it as a job. I love doing this. Uh, I hope to be able to do this uh, until till my dying breath. But, you know, we'll see what happens there. You know, no, nothing's promised. So, uh, but we'll enjoy the ride while it lasts and we'll do it all as one big family here, folks. So from all of us here at Diecast TV, thank you all and we'll see you back here tomorrow. Everybody have a great night. All right, here's another one of the Zuru metal machines. This one is White Fang. Good looking die cast on this one. Beast speed down the side with that roaring tiger. There we go. Got those gold rims on there. Got the spoiler in the front. If you'd like this one, all you have to do down in the comments, type in 10582. That is 10582. And here we have from Hot Wheels the 19. 69 Ford Mustang Boss 302. Check it out. Check it out. Sharp looking casting. Really sharp, sharp looking casting. This one is from the Muscle Mania. 3 out of 10. If you'd like this one, just go down in the comments. Very simple. Type in 10459. 10459. Hey there, folks. Krista here. We have M2 in conjunction with Lakewood Industries. That's what that L is on the door. We have metal on metal, rubber tires, included is another protective case inside there. Here we go, take a look, take a look. All right, and this is the 1956 Ford F100, 1956 Ford F100 truck. Cards in beautiful shape, really, really nice little casting. If you'd like this one, just type in 10540, 10540. All right, check this little one out from Matchbox Moving Parts. We have the Divco Milk Delivery Truck. The Divco Milk Truck uh, does have the moving parts, I guess. I'm thinking of probably those doors in the back there. If you'd like the Divco Milk Truck into your collection, just type in 10536. That's simple, 10536. You know why the best-selling automobile in the world is a Ford pickup truck? Well, I'll show you. Ford makes some awesome pickup trucks. Look at this 2019 Ford Ranger Raptor. Raptors are awesome, man. Look at this beautiful one. Baby blue. Look at all those uh, checkers on it. My goodness. Look at the knobby wheels. Oh, what a great truck from Hot Wheels Hot Trucks. That's right. New for 2019. Buy it now. Type in the number 60635. 60635. Wow, check this one out. Johnny Lightning, 50 years. Toyota Land Cruiser, pretty cool. It's a limited edition. It's a Mijo exclusive, one of 3,600 now. That's if you had the regular one. Now, this particular one is obviously, you can see the marshmallow wheels. <laughs> it's all white. It's a whitey. Yeah, it's a white lightning, of course. It's pretty cool. All the way white base. It's got all the tires that are marshmallow white. <laughs> you got to love that. It's a 1980 Toyota Land Cruiser, one of my favorite types of Jeeps. It's always had a nice, powerful engine in it. It was very cool, pretty superior for the time. All right, oh, this is the classic gold series, but this is wicked, so nice. It comes in this uh, plastic protecto as well. Um, it's already based around it. If you want to get this, very simply, it's an easy way to get a nice white lightning. 10285, it's the only one I have like this. If you want to get it, get it now. 
just put the number 10285 in the chat below. It's yours. Check out this Hot Wheels Mercedes C-Class. This was two of four cars in the 1995 Race Team Series 4. It's got the Hot Wheels badging, the blue, the white, the red. Looks really good with the tail fin there on that C-Class Mercedes. If Hot Wheels was a real race team, they'd be winning a lot. To add this car to your collection, put 60641 in the chat. That's 60641 in the chat. Grab it now. Hey, all you Hot Wheels fans, it is the custom Ford Bronco. It's a sweet one. Looks like a 70 or something like that. Sweet. All right, it's the Surf's Up edition. <laughs> it's going down to the surf, that's for sure. He's got the spare in the back. He's ready to go. He's got the little surf tempo on the side. Lights in the front. Looking good. Looking good. All right. I love these in convertible version, too. They're pretty cool. It's got a nice little stance. Got a little uh, nice lift kit on that bad boy, too. If you want it for your uh, collection there, no problem. Take the number 10126. Put that in the chat, and it's yours. That's number 10126. Well, let's check out this beauty, Ford, custom Ford Bronco. Actually, I just saw a Luke Bryan video yesterday, and it had almost the identical truck, even in red yesterday. Don't judge. All right. <laughs> Get the spare tire up there. You got your light bar, your roll bar. All righty. If you'd like this custom Ford Bronco, so simple. Down in the comments, all you have to do is type in the five-digit number. They're always there, and I read them out to you. 10596. This one here for the custom Ford Bronco. 10596. Check this pretty lady out. Jaguar XJ220 in the brilliant green. Got the little side scoops there going on. You got the uh, clear engine compartment. Lid on the back. A lot of detail on the inside too. You can actually see. I'm not sure if you can see that through the, uh, the windshield there. But this is the Jaguar XJ220. You'd like this one for your collection? Down in the comments, 10473. You know what to do, 10473. Alrighty, all my big tire monster truck dudes, check this one out. 1974 Ford F250. With the big open hood up there. With the engine, the light bars. There we go, there we go. And this is from Acme in conjunction with Firestone. Look at that sharp looking truck, sharp looking truck. 1974 Ford F250. If you'd like this one, just go ahead down in the comments and type in 10691. 10691.
Ross the Boss here, Johnny Lightning, Street Freaks, Black with Flames. Gotta love it, 1960 AMC Rambler Wagon Custom. You want to check out the flames on that bad boy. All right, take a look at that black. It looks beauty. All right, that's one of 2,000 in a limited edition. If you want to put this in your collection, and I know you might, uh, all you got to do is type in the number 10014 in the comments section. That's simple, 10014. Okay, folks, check this one out by Hot Wheels. Uh, of course, got a little rally car, a little Mini Cooper S challenge. This is number four out of six in the series. Got all the sponsorship and the stickers going down the side there. There you go. Little spoiler up on the back. I always try to get these, and you can see the little um, embossed logo up on the hood. Okay, if you like this one, just go ahead and type in 10549. One zero five four nine for the Mini Cooper. Hey there, my diecast friends. Here we have a twenty-one year old card in perfect condition. Check it out, Chevy Pro Stalker truck. There we go. Got the little wheelie thing in the back there going on in chrome. All the sponsorship stickers along the side, which. Wish my eyes were good enough to read all those, but <laughs> clearly this Hot Wheels on there, of course. So 2000 first edition Chevy Pro Stock truck. All you have to do if you want this on the way to you is type in 10620. 10620. Hot Wheel Premium Team Transport 69 Ford Mustang Bus 302 Retro Rig. Beautiful team transport. You want that team transport? Just type the number 13710. 13710. Well, hello, folks. Krista here. Here we have Tad's Taxi, which is the 1957 T Bird out of the Turbo Taxi series. This is number three out of four. Look at all the graphics we have up on that hood. The staggered wheels. There we go. If you'd like to add this one to your collection, all you do is go down in the comments, type in 10564. 10564. Check out this Hot Wheels Contemporary 32 Ford Vicky. It's got fire on the sides, chromed out rims, and an engine that's popping out in the front. In the back, we got those tailpipes all chromed out. This could be yours. Just type 60650 in the chat. 60650 in the chat and make this 32 Ford Vicky yours. Here we go, guys. You know, it's hard to believe sometimes the year, the age of these, these cards and the cars and the shape they're in. 1998, so we're talking 23-year-old car. Look, check it out. This is the Chaparral 2. Number 28 of 40 cars in this series. Here we go. If you'd like this one, just go ahead, type in 10576, 10576. Hey there, folks. Check out this Hot Wheels Premium. Beautiful, beautiful Euro hauler with the Mercedes-Benz 300 SL coming out of the rear. we got a real rider, metal on metal. Let's take a look at the card. Beautiful condition. Here we go. And there's that 300 SL coming out of the back. There we go. You can see it has the IWC racing on the side, your AMG logos, the details on the front as well. Super simple. All you have to do, type in 10414, 10414, if you'd like to add this to your collection. This beautiful Hot Wheels Premium, Real Riders, Metal on Metal, Mercedes-Benz 300 SL coming out of the rear of that beautiful Euro hauler. Again, 10414. Just type in 10414. All right, here we have one of Krista's personal favorites. I actually had the military version way back in the day uh, when the, the Humvees were just coming around. This, however, is the Hummer H2. And this one's in the yellow and black custom with the rack up top, with your gas cans, with your extra spare tire, and the roof rack. There we go. Limited edition, one of 3,600. There we go. 
take a peek at the back on this. Card's in excellent condition. If you'd like this beauty, just go ahead, type in 10519. That is 10519. Well, hello there, Diecast fans. Krista here. Here we have the Johnny Lightning, the active duty series. This is the 99 Ford F450 police tow truck. Uh, inside this case has another dis display case inside of there. You probably can't tell on the camera, but it does. Uh, this is a very, it's a special edition, pretty low numbered. This one's one of only 2,400. One of 2,400. Uh, I'm not going to bother really picking that up and going crazy, but it should because the, the ends of the boxes are like that, so you really, I can't really show you the front and back, but perfect condition on the case. As you can see, it says the police up on the hood, the light bar, and then of course you're a hooker in the back. And it says actually, let me see if I can see that. Number 28, Shore County Police. Shore County Police. So if you'd like to add this one, it is a special edition, special edition. If you'd like to add this one to your collection, just go ahead and type in 10410. Again, for this Johnny Lightning Active Duty 1999 Ford F450 tow truck, one of 2,400 folks, go ahead and just type in 10410, 10410. Hey folks, here we have another one from the Hot Wheels Decades. This represents the 1950s, first of eight, 1955 Corvette, obviously a convertible with all the flame graphics all around it. There we go. If you'd like this one, just go ahead and type in 10601. That is 10601. All right, guys, check this one out. 25, 26-year-old card. Look at this. 1995 model series, the Camaro convertible, number eight of the 12. There we go. There we go. Cards in great shape for the age as well. Great shape, a little bit of a, a little blemish right there on the top, but not torn. So 1995 model series Camaro convertible. All you have to do, go in and type 10528. That is 10528. Where are my Chevy Camaro lovers? Check out this modern muscle from Auto World. There's only 6,800 in the world. This is a 2020 release, too. I don't think it's in the stores yet. Version B, 2011 Chevy Camaro RSSS. Oh, man, the hood opens up rubber tires. Oh, if you love Camaros, my gosh, you got to get this for your collection. Type in the number 27016. That's 27016. Green light, baby. What a beautiful hauler. Check out this international Eurostar box van. Man, I love the people who serve our country. U.S. Army. Look at that, my friends. Thank you for your service. If you love Army vehicles like I do, you want to pick this up. Check out this gorgeous real rider, metal on metal, Army truck, international Eurostar box van. Get it now. All you have to do is type in the number 10098. That's 10098. Hey, hey, fellas, check this out. This just in. This is the Johnny Lightning Street Freaks uh, Spoiler 20. It's pretty cool. It's a 1967 Plymouth Barracuda. This is a limited edition. It's one of 2,000. Pretty awesome. Okay, this is in a metallic bright silver. Let's take a close look at this one. All right, look at that. Pretty cool. Let's take a nice look at that. Sweetness. I love the dark. I love the black engine in it. Blown all the way. Pretty awesome. This is version B. Now, this is just released. I just got them. The Johnny Lightning called me. They said they just got a shipment. I said, I want them. They threw them on, in a, uh, on UPS, and here they are. Brand new, spanking new. Can't find them anywhere. If you, have, you, know, you can't go out of the house, no problem. We bring it to you. All you got to do is take the number 10181 down. Put it in the chat and it's yours. So that's number 10181. Moon Equipment, check. Chevy Bel Air, check. 1957, beautiful Bel Air. 
Oh, 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 look at the front of that thing. Look at the detail, the chrome uh, bumper on there. Look at the flames on that. My friends, that is one amazing Chevy Bel Air 1957 Bel Air. Is there anything more iconic? Get it now. Type in the item number 09007. Zero nine zero zero seven. Hey folks, here we have produced by Hot Wheels from the Star Wars collection. This is number six of eight. Luke Skywalker and Yoda's Boulevard Bruiser. Check it out, check it out. Look at those side pipes. Look at the top. Card is in excellent condition. If you'd like this one for your collection, just go down in the comments, type in one zero five four three. That is one zero five four three. Do 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 Abbey Road, baby. Look at that album cover, Beatles album cover, diecast collectible from Corgi. Yeah, baby. Now pay attention. This is a gorgeous London cab. Now I have spent a lot of times in a London cab. I always went to London when I'm on working on television, and this is what a London cab looks like. And on Abbey Road, looks like this Abbey Road with the iconic Beatles crossing the crosswalk. There it is. Get it now. My goodness, if you're a fan of the Beatles like I am, you should get this now. How do you get it? Type in the number 10096. 10096. All righty, here we go, folks, with the Hot Wheels City. This is the 67 Austin minivan. Check it out. Look at all the graphics on this car. Got the British flag up top, and I love these wheels. I'm going to put this up really close so you can see these wheels. The wheels are kind of red, yellow, blue, silver. Isn't that cool? All righty. If you'd like this one, you get the yellow bumper in front. Here we go. If you'd like this one, just go right down in the comments. Type in 10652. That is 10652. Well, hello, where's my Johnny Lightning fans? Here we have the 1932 Ford Roadster. This one is four series for a total of 24 cars. This is series two, and this would be number nine. It is the series of the Nifty 50 Rods of the 50s. Limited edition, one of 15,000. If you'd like this for your collection, you simply type in 10413. Again, that's 10413. I'm going to pop this up here and see if I can show you. There we go. You see, it has a white interior. There we go with the front. It's not really a, a metallic paint on here, but uh, I don't know. It's pretty, um, has a little, pretty good little extra shine there to it. All right, there we go. And here we go. So, if you would like this 1932 Ford Roadster Limited Edition.